You're unbelievable. Oh, do 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 Hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? Uh, just getting the chat open here. It's a shame we can't. I guess pe most people have like a like a coming soon or like. You know what I mean? Like a, oh, stream starting soon kind of screen. Um, let's uh, pop out this chat here. I should probably do that. I tried to set up a, like a real fancy setup, but I think the computer that I was working on wasn't, um, wasn't up to snuff. Uh, so I think I got to use a more powerful computer. I was just using a Surface, which, you know, maybe that sounds like, Oh, duh, you're not supposed to stream with the Surface, you fucking idiot. But, hey, man, I don't know anything about streaming. Uh, anyway, how's everyone doing? Uh, let me just hide the chat on the phone. Yes, as promised. As promised long ago, Urza Saga. This is a real fucking Urza Saga box. Um, y'all helped make it happen, so y'all will get to see what is inside. And uh, I just want to preface, because you'll probably notice as I'm opening cards, um, my hands look a little dirty. Um, they're not actually dirty. Uh, I went foraging for black wal black walnuts. Um, and uh, you're supposed to get them, you know, after they fall off the tree and uh, and they're, they're all dried out in the sun. Um, but uh, I picked one up that wasn't fully dried out, and those things stain your hands like, whoa. So uh, I got this is like four days ago, this, this shit, and I've washed them like a thousand times. So it's just my hands are just stained. They're not actually dirty. So yeah, <clears throat> yeah, dark, dark nuts. That's great. Uh, hey, Antonio Henderson. Thanks, man. There's a saga. Woo, let's make some great polls, Aaron. Can't wait for the TCG channel soon. Yeah, that's going to be a setup as soon as I set up this. Uh, real s I, got, I got another light, too, up here. So um, the cards won't go dark. So, yeah, I'm like slowly upgrading the, the situation here. And uh, it's going to go real fun. Um, I'm going to take my time on this one because this is, you know, first of all, it's been a long time coming. And second of all, I mean, come on, it's... Fucking Urza Saga. Um, I've, got a, I've got a screen up here with all the prices listed out. Um, so if I pull like a big one, I'll be able to be able to check. Um, very stoked. Very, very stoked about this. Uh, use a hand. Um, just to, no, the cards can't get stained. This is literally, it's like, it, I, it, there's no way to like get this off. It's just, it, it is what it is. You know, like this little mark right here is... It's just my skin is stained. It won't, it won't transfer on anything. Um, got Streamlabs open. Um, genuinely, how's everyone doing today? Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to draw this out. I'm also thinking. Um, uh, I've got a Core Twenty Twenty One box collector's booster that I'm trying to that I'm that I'm trying to trying to be over here open. So maybe. You know, it's one box of this, one box of this, and then, and then we'll be done, you know? It's probably the biggest opening I've had so far, so. <clears throat> oh, well, who's, who's the spammer? Come on. Um, great, man. Well, hey, Chris Nunez, thank you. Uh, wow, this is old. I stopped playing during this set. Oh, shit, no shit. Well, so this is the set that has all the big boys. It's got Gaius Cradle, Gilded Drake, Sarah's Sanctum, Yogg Moth's Will, um, and Time Spiral. All of those are over $100 cards. Um, Gaius Cradle, anywhere from $400 to $700, depending on the condition, I guess. Um, and then, of course, a ton of super valuable and commons. We got Carpet of Flowers, Goblin Lackey, Turnabout, Reign of Filth. Scourge Familiar, and Windfall. Um, all of those around five, 
five or above, five dollars or above. Um, oh, thanks for the kind words on the Neat Wants to Battle uh, Lincoln Park cover. That was really fun. Um, sort of inspired by the the Infinite cover that we did, where uh, you know I I heard that song, the Infinite song, and it came out Infinite Theme from from Sonic Forces. And I immediately texted Nate and was like, we need to do a cover of this. And he was like, okay. Um, and it went so well that we, we, we sort of joked about doing like a Linkin Park cover because it was kind of like, oh, you know, it's like Shinoda and Bennington. Um, oh, damn. <clears throat> uh, wow, they're just rolling in. Holy shit. Uh, Harriet, welcome back. Hey, Aaron, best of luck with the polls today. These streams are the highlight of my week, and I enjoy learning about these cards. Also loved your cover and video with Nate Wants to Battle for In the End. Have a great day. Thank you. Yeah, I was just talking about that. Um, yeah, that was that was really fun. That was uh, I was I was actually kind of tired the day that we recorded that, so I was sort of worried that the music video was, like, taking so long to come out because I was like, uh-oh, did he not like the footage? Because I also, um, you know, I like Linkin Park, but I didn't... I didn't know the exact lyrics, so I kept like messing up the the uh, the video take because I was like, "Fuck, what does he say in that part again?" Um, so I had to like read a lot of it, so it might look like I'm like reading <laughs> off, of, off of a phone while I'm while I'm doing the 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 music video. Uh, Dark Angel, hey Aaron, super excited about this box. Hope it gets blessed. I'm glad you got into MTG. Enjoy this. You deserve it. Thanks, man. Wow, Kai White, hello, welcome back. Hello, I don't have anything clever to say. I love you. I love you too, Kai White. Um, previous history. Your previous openings have gotten me into starting, start collecting MTG cards. The art is too amazing not to get drawn into it. Keep up the chill streams. Thanks, man. I will. Um, I'm loving these. Absolutely love these. Uh, Joshua Tungate, thank you, Hair, and I love Game Grumps. You and Dan always make my day better watching you two play games and listening to you all. Dan, I'll teach you the way. Wow, thank you. Odd Grimm, shout out to anyone battling with mental health. You're not alone and you are loved. Wow, very kind of you, Odd Grimm. Um, agreed. Uh, Lumberjacks, thank you. Any plans on making a commander deck and playing some games with Dan? Yes, I have lots of commander decks. Um, I just, uh, it's tough to play. And Dan's never played commander as far as I know. <sighs> All right. Uh, enough, enough dilly-dallying. Enough... Uh, Let's, let's get this, and I feel, you know, it's like, I'm just going to throw this away. I'm not going to, like, sell the box or anything, but, like, my typical, like, this move is, I feel like, is, like, disrespectful for Urza Saga, so I'm just going gonna, gonna to do it, like, respectfully. Just open it up like a... There. <laughs> God, could you imagine being, like a, like, a card store owner and just getting, like, a palette of cases of Urza Saga. I'm just like, yeah, it's the new set, whatever. And then come to find out in 2020, the year of everything bad, these things have shot up to <laughs> 40 times. Is it 40 times? Yeah. Um... Ooh, beautiful. Wow. Look at this, man. Ugh. These old-ass packs. You know, I didn't really grow up on Magic, but, like, this just feel like, it's it's evoking that sort of, like, I grew up on Pokemon, so, like, seeing these packs just, like, evokes this, like, sort of old-fashioned feel. So, once again, uh, no foils in this set. Uh, all just value cards, so it's super easy to uh, test the value. Anybody want this? <laughs> Use clubs, please. Uh, you know, I don't have clubs. Sorry. I'll be gentle, don't worry. I'm, I don't sweat. I do sweat. I'm actually kind of a sweaty boy, but... Um, ah, shit. I need, uh, I need some penny sleeves. One sec. All right, got some penny sleeves. Should I sleeve every single card? 
Should I just sleeve like every every dang card? Let me move this down a little bit so I can get a little closer to the ah. So I can get a little closer to the cards. Oh, this should be nice. Yeah, and I can just hold them like this. It'd be great. Yeah, you can see my thumbs a little better now. How they're gross. They're clean. They're just stained. Um. All right. Here we go, baby. <laughs> Sleeve them all. <laughs> Sleeve every card. Wait, hold on, hold on. I feel like, yeah. I mean, there's the the the, the shitty commons in this are still like eight cents. Like it's. I don't know if I need to. Sleeve them all. Oh, we'll see. All right, let's let's do it, man. Let's let's just let's just jump into it. <laughs> I do that every time. All right. I don't know the order for these. Is it uh, uncommon and then rare and then commons? So we got vampiric embrace. I don't know what that. I don't know what's going on there. Guy's cradle second pack. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. God, that's creepy. Got a little, uh, what is that, hibernation? Ooh, excellent. Beautiful. God, these these old cards, like the borders and everything, got such a unique feel to them. I love it. Oh, is that the, oh, no, that's not uncommon. Enchantment alteration. Wow, love that. Love the colors. Look at that. We've targeted enchantment from one creature to another or from one land to another. That's pretty nice. Damn. And boom, that's the rare. Stroke of genius. Where's that lie on the on the value list? Probably not very. Oh, four dollars. <laughs> uh, target player draws X cards. That's great. Oh my God! Look at this creature. Look at this precious creature, Dromosaur. Oh my goodness! Don't you just want one of those? Don't you just want to invite him into your home? Ugh, oh, lovely creature. Duress, classic, classic card. Great art too. I'm not I'm not I'm not super up to date on the on the artists that are not okay anymore. So just let me know if I'm like, ooh, great art, and then it's like, oh no, that guy um killed millions. Like, okay. Uh Remote Isle comes into play tapped. Add oh, it's a cycle, cycle land. Very cool. We got Lull, beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh my god. Wow. Oh, it's Therese Nielsen. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, screw it. All right. Opal carry added. Wow. That's beautiful. That's a cool card. All right. Uh, when one of your opponents successfully casts a creature spell, if Opal carry added is an enchantment, Opal carry added becomes a 2 2 creature and counts as a soldier. Wonderful. One drop. Man, these are all so cheap. They're all so cheap to cast. Falter. Creatures without flying cannot block this turn. Got a little corrupt. <laughs> Fucking lasers coming out of the suit, man. Oh, my suit has been corrupted. Got Pendrel Flux. Larry. Why is everyone saying Larry? What's going on with Larry? Did I fuck something up? What? Wait, 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 wait. What's happening with Larry over here? Um... What? I'm sorry, I don't know what Larry is. <laughs> oh, the Dromosaur is named Larry? Did everyone name the Dromosaur Larry? Yeah. That's Larry. The duress is $10. Holy shit, alright. Whenever Dromosaur blocks or becomes blocked, it gets plus two, minus two until end of turn. They say, they say Dromosaurs are frightened of dogs, even little ones. There are no dogs in Shiv, not even little ones. Oh, but the Dromosaur's a little one. Well, it's Larry. All right, let's let's uh, let's leave that direct. Yeah, this is gonna this is gonna be like all all day. It's just gonna be like, oh, by the way, that um that common that's three hundred dollars. So go ahead and sleeve that, please. All right, duress is sleeved. Let me turn up the air a little bit. Whew. 
Sleeve Larry. Yeah, you know what? You got it. Larry's our boy. Larry's gonna be our sign. So I think I think I'm gonna have to Pokemon these cards. Uh if you if you know what I'm saying. We got Elvish Lyrist. I feel like this is Lyrist, sorry. I feel like this one is worth something. We got uh, Sarah Zealot. Very cool. We got Goblin Raider. He looks very upset. <laughs> somebody, somebody told him, somebody told him like, I don't like your hat, and he's like, Fuck you! I don't like my hat. I fucking like my hat. All right. All right. Great. That was our first pack. That felt pretty cool. Oh, I should probably sleeve the rare. Did I? I did not sleeve the rare. What the fuck am I thinking? All right, let's leave that rare. All right, dope. We're off to a good start. Actually, <laughs> we want the Larry. Let's just put let's just put Larry over here for good luck. Need the rares right here. Oh wait, you know what? Fucking Susie didn't bless. What the hell? Hey Susie, would you like to bless my packs? Susie and I just did some some spells last night, and uh, it was quite fun. It was protection, luck, all that kind of stuff. Wow! Did yeah. you have to bless the lucky ones? Oh yeah, this is this is the jam. Oh my god! Put it out in the moonlight last night for good luck and shit. Yeah, it was a full buck moon, a clip, a quarter eclipse last night. Yeah. It was beautiful if you saw it. Um. Okay, so what do you want? Uh, a lot. <laughs> uh, we're looking at Gaius Cradle, we're looking at Gilded Drake, Sarah's Sanctum, Yogmoth's Will, Time Spiral, Tolarian Academy, Exploration. Yeah. Okay. I'm feeling three of those right now, I can tell you. Whoa, 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 at least okay. three. Oof, at least three. Oof, oof. Oh, wow. Um, so, right. Um, mm -hmm. right, I'm putting all of my... <laughs> my daily energy allotment <laughs> into these cards, which feels like it's like forty percent of the regular daily. Yeah, it's like energy. don't don't like overexert yourself. I'll give you like thirty eight percent. Okay. Okay. Mm. Mm. okay. Yes, there are one, two, three. There Whoa. are three of those cards that you want. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Good luck. Thank you. I'll go upstairs with my two percent of energy left and finish cleaning. <laughs> you're you're a trooper, babe. You're a trooper. <laughs> I'm glad to help. Yeah, thank you. Tell the chat I said hi and good help. Wow. I think they heard you. Oh, good. <laughs> we want Larry. Bless Larry. Everyone's going, everyone's going wild for Larry. I, am I to assume that this is Larry? I'm, I still, I still am not in on the joke. This, this happened while I was opening cards, so I'm not totally in on the joke, but I feel like this is Larry, and I'm okay with that. I think he's great. I think he's adorable. Larry the Turtle. Yes, that's Larry. All right, let's see how many Larrys we can get. Uh, wait, hold on. We need to. We need to look up. Him. We need to look up Larry to see <laughs> if he's got any value, <laughs> which assuredly he does not. Eight cents. Larry is eight cents. So let's make let's make a let's make a playset of Larry happen. All right, I think what I'm gonna have to do is open these like upside down. One, two, three, four. Okay, I'm sort of Pokemoning them. So four in the back. We got Acridian. I have no idea what's going on here. Zero idea of what's going on here. We got second. <laughs> This is, a, this is a, how I feel after, I, I think Taco Bell's a good idea. Ugh, I feel so minus one, minus one right now. You got wild dogs. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Look at all those skinny dogs, man. They need to get some food. You got a headlong rush right there. Beautiful. Got that jumping dude. <laughs> I'm coming for you. Fucking dinosaur's got no idea what the hell's going on. He's just fucking like... Digging into a digging into a wall or something with a with a spike. I have no idea what's going on. Skittering scourge. Man, some of this art is just like, what the fuck is happening? Like there's like there's some creature with a face and legs, I guess. 
Damn. I need to get some more Larry over here. Wizard Mentor. I love how he's like pointing at the at the board, but like he's he's pointing like above the board. Like he's not pointing at anything in particular. Alright. We got that rejuvenate. Gain six life, and you can cycle it. Yeah, man, that looks fucking nice. That's where I want to be right now. God. To be a man dumping pond water on his head. We got a catalog. Very cool. We <laughs> All right, all right, all right. I understand. I understand that people want Larry. <laughs> Woo. Wait, what's going on? Do we got? Oh my God, we got some major. Okay, I'll, I'll check. I'll check the super chat after. <laughs> after we're doing this, we got catalog. Woo. This is this is a lot more intense than I thought it was. Hush. Destroy all enchantments. Very neat. Path of peace. I've left that world behind, and now I'm just a broad-shouldered man. Viashino Runner. Cannot be blocked by only one creature. They didn't even have a name for Menace yet. They just called it, called it like they sees it. It moved this way and that way, and then I could stick it. It jumped over my head and was gone. Is this the first Menace card ever? Ooh, we're on to the... Yeah, we're in the comments now. Veiled Sentry. It's fucking dope. I'm into that. It's like coming out of the wall. It's like this is this was uh this is Mario 64, like like four years after, after he got some training and stuff. Got Shiv's embrace right here. I don't know what he's embracing, but uh just kind of flying really. You got tree folk seedlings. <laughs> Look at these fucking goopy creatures, dude. <laughs> it looks like they're in like a 90s music video. <laughs> Yo, listen up, man. <laughs> the tree folk seedlings. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Sound off. Yo, my name is Larry. <laughs> I'm 35. Hanging out with my boys tonight. Yo, I'm Marvin. Everybody loves me. Don't fly above me. Anyway. <laughs> What's the rare? Sporogenesis. Here we go. Damn, look at that. It's a four drop. During your upkeep, you may put a fungus counter on target non-token creature. Whenever a creature with a fungus counter on it is put into a graveyard, put a sapperling token into play for each of those fungus counters. Treat those tokens as 1-1 one, one green creatures. When Sporogenesis leaves play, remove all fungus counters from all creatures. Eh, that's alright. That's not, that's not a great... Not super great. Read the flavor texts. Uh, great. Well, is there anything in there that should have... Uh... <laughs> All right, let's go to these super chats, because GD, man, look at this. Oh, my God, what the fuck? There's so many. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why, why did this all happen? Okay, uh... <laughs> thank you, I mean... Um, okay, Zach Swanson. Afternoon, Aaron. In regards to collecting original sketches for MTG art, do you generally go to the artist directly, or do you rely on the Facebook group or other sources? Much love. Yeah, I do the Facebook group. Um, I'm pretty new to it. Uh, Tyler the Crafter. Thanks for the magic videos, Aaron. I'm new to MTG and enjoy hearing what you have to say. Keep on rocking. You too, Tyler. Uh, Delson Cox. Curious if you have a fave alt art from M21. Uh, you know, probably Lily. I mean, that's all there is to it. Fucking Lily. Yo, guys, I get you're excited for Larry, but, uh... No, there's, there's, there's a lot of other cards going on here, too. <laughs> I need to, I need to spend all this cashola on, on Urza Saga, and everyone's just excited about Larry, although... It's pretty cute. Uh... Kevin Marvin, thank you. Hey, Aaron, love you, bud, and love Game Grumps. Happy to see you into MTG. Any chance Game Grumps will do a playthrough of Donkey Kong 64? Uh, maybe, I don't know. Uh, again, that's one of those games that I didn't grow up playing, so I don't want to, like, ruin people's... The people are very fond of that game. Uh, Alexander, hey, Aaron, loving the MTG streams. Convenient that I also just started playing recently, too. Real talk, though. How much do I have to donate to get more Sonic Heroes? Today, episodes was a riot. Ah, thanks, man. Um... I don't know, we'll think about it. I mean, we I think we gave out a call that was like, hey, should people um should people uh 
Wait, should we play more of this? I'm getting conflicting messages from people in emails and comments and stuff. People are like, yes, absolutely. The only true ending is to play all of them. But then some people are like, no, this game sucks. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Um, Clifton Knight. Hey, Aaron. Uh, I'm so glad to see how into magic you've gotten. I'm playing Sekiro on my laptop while watching this. Oh, that's awesome, man. I fucking love Sekiro. Sekiro. Uh, Spencer Wishart, hey Aaron, can't wait to see you guys play Ross's Super Mario Maker World. He's been doing super cool work on it. Yeah, I know he's been getting really good at it. Um, I'm I'm really really excited to to see that work. He's very adamant. He's like, don't play any of these levels, play them all as a world. It's like that's the whole point. So I've been holding out. I haven't been watching. You know, every every so often I'll I'll jump in and and you know I'll, I'll check out what he's doing, but I don't want to spoil it for myself. Um, I usually watch his VR streams because I don't. Uh, I can't, I can't, he, he's forbade me from watching the Mario Maker stuff. Um, Alex Forrester, thanks, man. Hey, Aaron, if you were invited, would you be a guest on Critical Role? Absolutely. You and them create my favorite content on the internet. Uh, yes, I love, I love everyone there. Um, I know Matt and Marisha very well. Um, um, I, I would love to do that. I, I think they're the, the kindest coolest people ever um rusty ralston thank you thinking about making a meme where some random sonic fan no you're supposed to play the other three sonic hero stories no and you haha i hate this game by the way agreed <laughs> yeah i mean dude it's really bad i'm not gonna lie sonic heroes is really really bad so uh we'll see man we'll see if people really want it I mean, it's, you know, it's doing pretty well, and, like, I'm really happy with the episodes. I think they're funny. So, uh, uh, we'll see, man. Maybe I'll give it a shot, like, off-camera and see if it's even, you know, worth it in terms of, like, content. Uh, Rusty Ralston again. Uh, seriously, though, I get what you went through with Sonic Heroes because I have PTSD and OCD and anger issues and stuff, and I just want to give you a big hug, man. You deserve it. Thanks, man. I mean, that, that, that sounds like a handful. Um, but uh, you're a fucking trooper for sticking it out. Uh, Gillenborg, 91. Hello from Sweden, Aaron. Been a fan of yours since awesome series on NG. I've been wondering about something. During a stream, when asked about the FF7 RE, you claimed you liked the flow and feeling of the original better. Does that mean you actually like Final Fantasy? Yeah, yeah, I've got very fond memories of Final Fantasy. Love 6. Um, I played through most of 3, the, the actual 3, um, the remake. And that was like, you know... That was a classic RPG. N not super compelling, but it's fun. Um, Chrono Trigger is one of my favorite games of all time. Um, I mean, I know that's not a Final Fantasy game, but... Uh, yeah, R RPGs are... I mean, fucking RPGs. Like, <laughs> I love RPGs. Uh, classic ones. I feel like they've gotten a little drawn out um, recently. Those, those old ones were very, like, succinct and straight to the point. Not a whole lot of grinding. Uh, Odd Grimm... Hey, Aaron, have a chunk of my rent. Oh, my God. Wow. Holy shit. I didn't even see that. Thank you. Um, oopsie poopsie. <laughs> Let's touch butts one day. Anyway, have a good, good day, everybody. You know, I touch butts with you. Leonardo F. V. 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 Oh, man. Here we go. <laughs> it's starting. Leonardo F. Vieira. Love you, Aaron. Love you, too, man. Um, Brianna Kelly. Yas, girl. Keep them coming. You the man. Thank you. All right, I have a request. I know Larry is a good bit, um, but let's let's forego the Larry spam, unless Larry actually shows up, unless uh, unless there's a new Larry. All right, I'll make that a rule. No more no more Larry unless Larry becomes a thing again if he shows up. All right, so get out of your system. We're having a good time. We're opening Urza Saga. There's a lot of cool cards in here that's not just Larry. Uh, okay, pure. Purified Storm, thank you. You're going to play Zelda Link's Awakening, Beat Majora's Mask, Sonic Colors, Sonic Generations this year. Play Sonic Adventures. It's like a Zelda game. Star Fox Adventures, huh? I've heard things. I've heard things about that. Uh, Pro Snow 8000. Look out for Expunge Hidden Gorillas Shower of Sparks. They're Christopher Moller's. Oh, okay. I heard he retired, so that's very sad. Um, I'm actually... I'm very disappointed. I mean, you know, whatever. He should retire if he feels he needs to. But it's like, ah, oh man, no more new Christopher Muller? What a bummer. Uh, 
Rusty Ralston again. Playing Star Fox Adventure sounds better than looking at Vegas Crash for like the fifth time today. I don't know what Vegas Crash. Oh, Vegas, the the Sony Vegas. Got it. Yes, those uh, those video editing programs. Holy shit. Oh my god, there's so many. What what wh what happened? Where where did all this come from? Um. All right. Uh, let's open another pack, <laughs> and then I'll get to more more super chats. I think we're getting the cradle in this one. I can feel it. I can feel it a little bit. Man. Alright. Gotta do gotta do a Pokemon style. Four to the back. Okay. So the rare's in the back. We got Dark Ritual, baby. Add black to your mana pool. This has got to be a value card, right? This has got to be a value card. Uh, unnerve. Each of your opponents chooses and discards two cards. Nice. We got that Rune of Protection green. <laughs> She's like, mm -mm 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 -mm. I've got the Rune of Protection. Uh, we got that Rescind. Rescind? Rescind? Okay. We got that Via Shino Outrider. Oh, wait. Is that our boy? <laughs> Is that our boy? I'm thinking that's our boy. There's a Larry right there. I didn't know he was in multiple cards. Give thy ration to thy mount if the road be long. So saith the bay. <laughs> yeah, bay said it. I called up bay. Yeah, she was like, yo, give, give that fucker some rations. <laughs> Retromancer. He shoots out uh, old Nintendo sprites. Slippery Karst. Hardly knew her. Uh, despondency. <laughs> That's how I look when I'm like tired and I still want to like play the board game and everyone's still going. Uh, Brilliant Halo. Very cool. Disenchant. Classic. Classic art for that. Wow. <laughs> no! My fucking whatever that is! Got Cloak of Mists here. Very cool. Oh, we're running the commons now. Claws of Gix. God, that looks like a photo. Is that a photo? It looks like a photo. <laughs> Alright, Larry's done. You guys <laughs> you guys go too hard on Larry. You guys way, go way too hard on the Larry. There's a Larry window. Okay. <laughs> Confiscate. You control enchanted permanent. Very cool. Uh, waylay. Put three night tokens into play. Treat those tokens as yeah, that's fine. And what do we got here? Baron, Master Wizard. Oh, they just they just put him in core twenty twenty one. Baron Master Wizard counts as a wizard. He's the three drop. Sacrifice a permanent, return target creature to owner's hand. Look at him. I love my beard, not gonna lie. Knowledge is no more expensive than ignorance, and at least is satisfying. Baron Master Wizard. He's a 1-1. One, one. What a loser, dude. 1-1? One, one? Can't beat anyone. Let's throw him in the rare pile. Boom. I'm gonna get a fan in here. I don't know why it's so hot. What's going on? Fucking hot in this club, yo. Gotta cool this shit down. Get some get some vibes, dude. Are we vibing over here? Cause I'm feeling like we're vibing right now. I'm sure this is very entertaining, me trying to plug in a fan. Just, I just want to be vibing right now and like, 
The situation is making me just not vibe. Got one of them fancy schmancy Dysons. All right. So we got, you know what? Let's make a little Larry collection since everyone seems to be so stoked about Larry. Here's a... All right. Too many Larry cards we can collect. And uh, of course I'm going to sleeve the Larry. What are you... What are you nuts? What are you, what are you people nuts over here? All right. Let's do one more pack and then... All right. Oh. There's dissent among the chatters. No, oh, damn it. It's, it's so hard to... Why did they make it so far away? No, no, no. Stop! <laughs> God damn it. This fucking chat's moving too fast. Okay. <laughs> Alright, boom. There we go. Okay, cool. Woo! Alright. It's a bummer that I gotta open it up and then see, like, the first uncommon card. But maybe it's because... Maybe y'all can't see it, so... Alright, we got Talarian wins. Discard any hand. Discard your hand and draw that many cards. That's pretty good. Gorilla Warrior. <laughs> that tree looks like a banana. <laughs> I like banana. Just a 3-2 for 3. Lame. Dark Ritual once again. Got that Racine once again. Oh, there we go. Good old Larry right there. Despondency. Oh, getting a lot of the same shit. Goblin War Buggy. <laughs> Look at this fucker. <laughs> What is Echo? During your next upkeep after this permanent comes into your control, pay its casting costs or sacrifice it. Oh. It's a 2-2 two -two with haste for two that you gotta pay for every time. That sucks. <laughs> Tiny little boy there. We got a hidden spider. Jeez, man, that's fucking gruesome. <laughs> it doesn't look very hidden. Look, there's a giant spider over there. Oh, shh, that's the hidden spider. Oh, I don't know. I can see him pretty well. Rune of Protection Red. Oh, she's still looking sassy about it. She's like, mm-mm-mm, -mm -mm, got that Rune of Protection. We got the Hermetic Study. <laughs> this fucking dude's eyes, dude. <laughs> Have you seen this fucking Hermetic Study, dude? <laughs> nah, man, I'm just warming my hands on the fire. Dude, this is unreal. Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here are the uncommons. Presence of the Master. Jazz hands! Alright. Damn, dude. This chat's blowing up. Alright. I think slow mode is on, you guys. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I think there's just too many people in here. Alright. Damn, yo. Uh, go ahead. Yeah, I gotta do some moderating, bro. Gotta do some frickin' moderating. Turn off Larry mode. <laughs> oh, man. How the hell? I am... I am heckin' muting people, but then they are... Oh, that's my bad. That's my bad. Okay. Cool. There we go. We got hopping on hopping automaton. Got this very strange like proportion situation going on. <laughs> it's just a, he's just hopping mad. Diabolic servitude. God, that's gross. <laughs> this fucking guy. Oh my god, I love him. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm so diabolical. <laughs> He's like, no! The snakes! Uh, Rune of Protection lands. That's pretty nice. Don't know if that's a value rare, but I'll take a rare nonetheless. 
I'll take a rare. It's not a lair, but it is a rare. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ugh, all right. So the people who weren't here originally, the reason it's 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 my it's stained. All right, my my nails are stained. Unfortunately, I can't clean it off. It just has to come off naturally. This was from like four days ago. My hands are as clean as can be. Um, I, I got I got my hands in a uh, uh, black walnut seed. So it got super stained. Now let's go through some super chats because holy shit, there's so many. Matthew McManus. Hey, Aaron, thanks for being an inspiration to do what I love. I've got into magic recently and I'll be going to grad school soon for music performance. Hey, good luck, man. That's awesome. I've always wanted to do music. I mean, I I have a band with three albums, but <laughs> like, like an instrument. Um, Christian Aguilar. Hey, Aaron, I'm a level two magic judge. Oh, sweet. And I want to say, what? can I call you? Can I call for you when I need judge? Uh, and I want to say, watching you open boxes reminded me of what I love about the game, the community, and how important magic has been for me. Hope to see you at large, at a large magic event someday. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm not very good. I've been doing that standard meta game on uh, Magic Arena, and I like can't get past like two wins. I'm fucking terrible. I'm also not using standard meta decks, so that would explain it. Um, Jessica Semeca, Aaron, you keep teasing me with these streams. I keep hoping for Pokemon. Also, give Larry a kiss. He has been kissed. Um, yeah, I know. I got to get those Pokemon streams going. Uh, Brittany Doro. I play Yu-Gi-Oh! Not Magic. However, I love watching your pack openings. Thanks a bunch for streaming. Ah, oh, thank you. Yeah, I got to get into Yu-Gi-Oh! Octopimp uh, says he'll teach me, so I just got to just gotta hit him up for that. Uh, the Loose Groose. <laughs> Hard Case Larry, right the heck now. Also, shout out to... Oh, yeah, you got it. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and... Ah, get this fucker out. Oh, where am I? Where are the perfect fits? Where are the perfect fits? Shit. Fucking drawer stuck. Ah, let's get the, get the fucking perfect fits. Ooh, I gotta be careful with this one. Ooh. All right. Oh, man. Whoa. Do you think? I think uh, I think this is gem mint. You think I'll get uh, get get a little value out of this one? Whew, I know, I know. It's this fucking sleeve won't go in. Go in there, dude. Fucking get the hell in there. Dude, Larry's got too much power. He won't accept the sleeve. All right, just throw throw Larry in there. Very nice. Boom. Dromosaur. Yes. Hard cased. Done. I think that's the first Larry that's ever been hard cased in, in history. <laughs> so, you're all a part of something special. Uh, okay, the Loose Grues. Uh Also, shout out to Jess. She's wonderful and a fab artist and means so much to me. Uh, hey, Jess. The Loose Grues says hi. Screw JK and the Turfs, too. <laughs> yeah, fuck that shit. I'm fucking done. I can't believe she doubled down on it today and was like, um, what I meant to say was they're mentally ill. And it's like, all right, dude. Uh, Dark Angel, uh, paid five euro to remind you of the blessings. Anyway, glad you're doing this. Enjoy. You deserve it. And more hi from the Basque country. I don't know what the Basque country is, but that sounds fucking delightful. Uh, thank you, man. The Bick Lord. Hey, Aaron. Love getting to watch these since you and Dan are doing these remotely for the time being. Could y we see you two playing MTG Arena together? Uh, yes. I think so. I absolutely think so. Um, Jason Ramalho, thank you. Yo, dude, love your magic opening. Me and the GF opened a 2021 booster box this week. Pulled out two Grim Tutor and one Teferi Master of Time. Stoked. Those are good pulls, man. Good work on that. Uh, Jeff McKell, you know, it's weird, Grim Tutor is, like, sort of the, everyone's like, oh, shit, but I haven't seen a single Grim Tutor, um, at, when I've been playing recently, so, it's interesting that, I guess it's more of a commander card. Uh, Toxic Toucan, hey man, so looking forward to these cards, as an aside, my sister and I hated Sonic Heroes so much as kids that we used our dad's blowtorch to melt the tiny GameCube disc, F that game, LOL. <laughs> 
No shit. <laughs> that's 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 brutal, man. I, I wouldn't go that far. Although maybe I would. A single pedal. Hey, welcome back. Hey, Aaron. I hope you're well. On behalf of the Ninja Pedal Zines, we just released our new zine of the Ten Minute Power Hour Zine. We raised 181 so far. Oh, that's awesome. Um, where can I find the Ten Minute Power Hour Zine? Uh, Severald Myrtles fan. Oh, that's uh, fuck. Is that Leona? I think that's. I think they told me that their name is Leona. Hey, Aaron, I have no idea what Larry means, but I'm cracking up at the chat today. Random question, but does Allie run the social media for all Grump stuff, including your uncle's? She's amazing. Uh, no, my uncle runs his. Um, and But yes, yeah, she does uh, Game Grumps on everything. Andy Lane. Hey, Aaron, can I play Arena with you? Have you thought about doing MTG content? Could get in on some Game Nights episodes or LRR, buying used DVDs and meth. Okay. I don't know what that last line was, but... Uh, yeah, I'm going to try to do a, lo a lot more gameplay and stuff. Um, Marcos, if you're a Final Fantasy fan, have you and Dan slash any of the other grumps thought of playing the upcoming Crystal Chronicles remake on the channel? Absolutely. I love Crystal Chronicles. Grew up on that shit. Fucking love that game. Think it's brilliant. Um, would absolutely love to play Crystal Chronicles. Uh, Kai Quirin, um, make sure you have your Platinum Angel so you know you cannot lose. Don't worry about my name. Also, Mike Hoochie's Harry. What? <laughs> Uh, what did I say about Larry? What did I say about Larry? You get your Larrys out, and then you save it for when Larry actually shows up. It's not special unless it's limited. You can't Larry all the time, and then when we actually get a Larry, it's no big deal. Gotta understand. You gotta understand anticipation and payoff. <laughs> that's, just, that's just simple storytelling, you guys. Uh... Okay, where, where was I? Uh, okay, KP, hey, welcome back. Guess it's time for my third attempt, and I've given, and given I've gotten closer and closer each time, I think third time's the charm. So let's say Gaia's Cradle is eight packs from now. Eight's my lucky number. Okay, cool. Let's say, all right, all right. All right. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it'll be this one when we reach the second stack. Um... Kai White, anyways, love you, moi. Love you too, Kai White. Also, again, Kai White. Hi, kind of weird question, but maybe you'd like to play Super Alpha Rad World 2 on Mario Maker. It has very interesting and fun mechanics, though it's pretty hard. I'll give it a shot. Um, I sent a message to Alpha Rad the other day. Um, seems like a nice guy. Alex Collins. Hi, Aaron. Hope you and everyone at Grumps is doing well during the Backstreet Boys reunion tour. Great bit, by the way. Thank you for being you and spreading laughter and positivity in these difficult lives. Thanks, man. Yeah, we're trying to do our best. Uh, Robert Garrity, love you, Aaron. Is there a good online game to get into that MTG world without sifting through millions of cards? Um, yes, Magic the Gathering Arena. It is free. And they give you welcome decks to play with, and it's great. Um, Gillenborg91, thank you. Uh, back again. Only half the dono of the last time, though. I have another question. Will Game Grumps or Starbomb ever tour in Europe again? Uh, absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Love touring. Um, can't wait to get back to it. Gaming Med Casper. Thank you. Could you could you get JonTron to guest? I don't know about that. Or have stopped talking together. I'm sorry if that's a stupid question. Sorry, I use Google Translate. <laughs> oh, that's, that's sweet. Uh, no, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Sir Sweezy. Sup, Aaron? Got an idea for you. Well... IG for you and Dan, Spelunky. Oh, Spelunky's great. It's on Xbox and it's the most BS game I've ever played, but I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Thank you, man. Yeah, yeah, I love Spelunky. It's a great game. Um, that's interesting to play that on Game Grumps. I'll think about that. Angel Eduardo Garcia Perez, here, here you one dollar, now say my name. <laughs> Dance. Dance, monkey. Uh... Kai White, also for your stake, slow mode is not on. Oh. Is it not? How do I turn it on? Uh, I don't know how to turn slow mode on. Am I a fool? Am I a, am I a gosh dang fool? Uh, I have it on top chat, which is... I, I assumed was what slow mode was. 
Uh, I don't know how to turn slow mode on, though. Let's see. Um, turn slow mode on YouTube. I don't want to watch a video, I just want to. Uh, live chat basics. Yeah, that's the only, um, yeah, yeah, it's on. It's, it's, it's called Top Chat now. It's called Top Chat, which seems a lot more, like, like, insulting. It's like, these are Top Chats, and, uh, like, Slow Mode actually, like, describes what's happening. Um, okay. Let's get back to it. Uh. Previous history. Klav Gix is a photo. The artist only has four MTG cards, but they are all of his sculptures, and he's the only one with real photos as MTG cards. Oh, okay, cool. So I was right. Excellent. Um, Nitrous Oxide 72, do you play Commander? Please play Commander. I love what you do. Uh, I do, but it's tough while we're stuck indoors. Uh, Biff Dude 1, can I buy a signed Larry? Oh. Well, there's only one Larry so far, and he's in the hard case, so I don't know. Maybe if we hit another Larry... Uh, Cat Flail, finished making my orc bikers. Love Larry. Love Larry, too. Uh, Toxic Toucan, we thought we were super edgy when we were kids. Got in a heck of a lot of trouble for that stunt. Oh, uh, about the... Scrolling down. Oh, for the blowtorch thing. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'd probably get in trouble, too, for that. But py pyro stuff is always, like, a, like a... You know, adults that are, like... My kid burned something. It's like, uh-oh. He's going to be a serial killer. Like, 100%. Um, a single pedal will at you on Twitter and link you the Power Hour zine or message on Instagram. Thank you. Uh, Twitter's better. Vetroid. Uh, your streams got me back over the edge into magic again, and I just un finished unpacking a 2021 display. By the way, have you seen the rambunctious mutt card in the set? Yeah, it's adorable. I think you would appreciate it. Yeah, not a super useful card, but hilarious nonetheless. Um, always, gets, always gets left behind in the drafts. Uh, Twilight Vestige, any chance of an Animal Crossing Island Tour on GG? Um, I did one on IGN. Uh, if you Google Eager After Island Tour, you'll find one. You'll find it. Uh, Remnant Fracture, is it just me, or do you somehow get more enraged at Sonic Heroes rather than Boom or Sonic and the Black Knight? Yes, because Sonic Heroes is... It's madness. It's, it's, it's fucking madness. Like, it's... Uh, Sonic Boom or Sonic and the Black Knight, like, feel solid. They feel like games. But... Sonic Heroes just it's it's like it, it like pokes you constantly and the controls suck. Ugh, I just I can't get enough of how terrible it is. Ariel Rosenthal, ever hear of a Dreamcast game called Cool Cool Tune? I have. It's a cel shaded music game made by SNK that never got a US release. You and Dan would love it. I actually had the um Neo Geo Pocket Color version of that. Uh Asteros, As Asteroth Astral. Been watching you for nearly eight years now and want to say you starting magic was just like me, I walked into a shop and got a deck and now have thousands. Yep, yeah, there it is. Uh, Harry, whoa, man, so many super chats. All right, we're, we're almost through these. Harriet, forgot to say, I pulled two lilies as well as the other Planeswalker cards in Core 2021 pre-release, nice, and Booster Box I got on Friday. Sadly, not full art, but was very happy with the pulls. Yes, that's very nice. Love that lily. I'll pull as many lilies as I want. Is a, is a, is a, I will pull... I will be happy to pull as many lilies as it is willing to give me, is what I'm trying to say. I'm sort of brain dead because of uh, just, just talking through the super chats. Um, Alex Issel, I love watching you open packs, man. I hope you pull a rewind. Um, honestly, my favorite counter. And keep your fingers crossed that I turn out being compatible to donate part of my liver to my bro-in-law. Oh, wow. You can donate part of your liver? I, that's, that's amazing. Uh, Yes, uh, fingers crossed on that one. Uh, Christian Aguilar, thanks again. I'd love to answer any rules questions. Reach out anytime. I miss answering questions at events and my LGS, and that's how I have fun with the game. Yeah, absolutely. Sir Sweezy, have you ever got the secret ending in Spelunky? I uh, haven't. 
I'm asking because I want to know if it's actually possible. Even my buddy tore our hair out trying. Uh, uh, no, I've never done that. Uh, Dark Angel, thank you. Love to know about Larry and other cards, but would love to see you in the Basque country. It's a small part of Spain, which has its own language and is probably older than Latin itself. A lot of nature. Wow, that's amazing. Are you kidding me? I would love to do that. All right, let's do some cards. I, I miss traveling like a, like a mother. And I feel like I do have to mention it every time, but my hands are just stained. They're not dirty. All right. Let's do four to the back. Okay, we got Disciple of Grace. Very dramatic. Very dramatic card. We got Annul. That's like, um, oh, it's straight up disenchant, but in blue. And it costs one less. Oh, it's a counter spell, though. We got Raise. Man, all these spells are so cheap. They're so cheap. All right, Blanchwood Tree Folk. <laughs> Look at this fucking. <laughs> I fucking love this guy. Yo, uh, D. Terlizzi. It's like my new favorite magic artist. Like, <laughs> this shit rules. Just, uh, hello. <laughs> Fortitude. Hell yeah. It's fucking awesome. Dramatic. Looming Shade. <laughs> Don't look at my face. It's a skeleton face. Angelic Page. Very nice. Rebecca Gway. Is that my new favorite artist? Please don't tell me Gway is canceled. Uh, Tolarian wins. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Turn that music down! Sorry, bud. Oh my god. Horseshoe crab! It's just straight up a horseshoe crab! And you can untap him by paying blue! <laughs> it's just a fucking horseshoe crab! <laughs> Is there, a, is there a card that's, like, not a token in Magic that's just, like, dog? 1-1. One, one, dog. In the final days... I'm, I'm glad he has flavor text. Let's read this. In the final days before the disaster, all the crabs on Teleria migrated from the inlets, streams, and ponds back to the sea. No one took note. Yeah, no one took note because they're fucking horseshoe crabs. Like, nobody gives a shit. Fucking horseshoe crabs. I love them. He can hang out with Larry. Uh, I'm going to call him uh, Jordan. <laughs> Jordan. Jordan the Crab. Goblin Spelunkers. Wow, I just saw this and I was like, is this like a chat window that's open right here? We got Gorilla Warrior once again. We got Retaliation. Wow, man. Very dramatic. <laughs> come at me. No, come at me. <laughs> We're so close. Ooh, Goblin Lackey. That's one of them. That's one of the big boys. That's one of the big boys. That's a sleever. That's a sleever. Ooh, we're going to sleeve this bad boy. All right, let's put that over here. Carpet of Flowers, that's another sleever. Oh, snap. Ow. And then the rare is Hidden Stag. That was, a, that was an uncommon pack. Oh, let's read the, the rare. The rare's got a lot of text and shit. Uh, it's a two drop. Whenever one of your opponents plays a land, if Hidden Stag is an enchantment, Hidden Stag becomes a 3 2 creature that counts as a beast. Oh, okay. Whenever you play a land, if Hidden Stag is a creature, Hidden Stag becomes an enchantment. <laughs> hidden Stag, I love that. I'm hidden. Mm -hmm. Jordan the Horseshoe Crab. Jordan Barrier just hanging out over there. Just having a good time. Jordan Larry, sorry. It's Larry. Seems to be some confusion over whether... I think this one's Barry. I think everyone dubbed this one Barry, and that one's Larry. They're friends. They probably hang out together, go bowling. You know, you know how it goes. Jordan. Oh, yes. Yes, it is, it is Jordan. Spelled with the, with the, the G and the E and the O. <laughs> Jordan. All right. Let's do... Let's Pokemon it up for the back. Exhum. Oh, this is a, this is one of the good ones, yeah? Exhum. Pegasus Charger. <laughs> Fucking legs are going everywhere, dude. Curfew. <laughs> now you stay inside. 
Okay, I guess I'll read. <laughs> but I'm not tired. Well, you're gonna be tired. Uh, goblin matron. <laughs> I fucking love the goblins, man. D D Terlizzi, man. Did do they still do? Uh, do they still do? Still do card art? Sandbar merfolk. <laughs> He's fucking. Oh, I thought those were his hands. He's got little swords. I thought he was like, mm, I've got long fingers. Smoldering crater. Looks like a land. Sings like a land. We got expunge over here. We got expunge. Is that a good one? Destroy target non artifact. Non black creature. This creature cannot be regenerated this turn. That seems kind of expensive. Uh, Disciple of law. Very cool. Love the haircut. Rays. Got that Blanchwood Tree Folk again. Got that Angelic Page. Wirecat. Wirecat cannot attack or block if an enchantment is in play. Boy, that must suck to be. Boy, that sucks to be Wirecat. Oh, gee whiz. Priest of Gix. Who's Gix, dude? Wait, when Priest of Gix comes into play, add three black to your mana pool? This is a free card. This has got to be worth something. That's a fucking free card. It's a free 2-1. And Zephyr's Embrace. What? Oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> I saw it was a fucking land, and I was like, holy shit, dude. <laughs> Stand, is Thran Quarry pretty good? At the end of each turn, you control no creature, sacrifice Thran Quarry. Add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Oh, that's got to be worth something. Yeah, man. And Zephyr's Embrace. He gives a fuck. He gives a fuck. Alright. Let's throw these bad boys in there. Four dollars for that? Yeah, I don't have gloves. I feel like I'm not a real, uh, not a real unboxer. Let me get some water. This is fucking getting hoarse over here. All right. Oh shit! I just fucking I did like three other things. I did like three other things, and then not the thing that I went out for. Did anybody else do that? I do that all the time. I'm just like, I'm gonna go do this thing, and then just don't do it. Oh, did I open this pack already? Here we go. Pokemon it. Got that scrap. Scrap. Let's see if we can bring this light. A little bit more over here. There. Once again, another Exhum. We got that Pegasus Charger. Bog Raiders, dude. Got Swamp Walk, dude. Creature's unblockable. There's a little tutu there. A little tutu. Healing salve. <laughs> now you use this salve, missy. She's like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean. Okay. Got that Smoldering Crater. Got that Bravado. Oh, man. <laughs> Look at these creatures. Look at this fucking little sundress. Oh, I love it. <laughs> it's like, do you think I look fancy? Uh, yeah, pretty good. Thanks, man. I'm going swimming later. Got Elvish Herder. 
Got Expunge. Got that Disciple of Law. Absolute Grace. Absolutely. Goblin Cadets. <laughs> oh, man. That dude's fucking mad. <laughs> Uh, we got that vile requiem, dude. Got that vile requiem. Intrepid hero. Three drop, one one, destroy target creature with power four or greater. Wow, that's mm, that's not bad. That's that's some pre that's some pretty useful shit right there. Ah, uh, let's just leave that, baby. Hmm. Only one Larry and one Horseshoe Crab so far. <laughs> Wait, what are we talking about? That car exploded. Is that... <laughs> is that a... Oh, the, intre the Intrepid. That was my car. Wow, you guys are amazing at, like, remembering shit that I say. <laughs> I forgot... <laughs> That was my car, the Intrepid. Jesus. Alright. We got Spire Owl. It's got Flying. 1-1. One, one. Top four cards of your library. Put them back in any order. Scry and move around. Retromancer! da 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 Alright. Slippery Karst. <laughs> This is definitely... If this card was in Arena, it would definitely come out and go like... You know what I'm saying? Arc Lightning. Arc Lightning deals three damage divided as you choose among any number of targets. That's kind of cool. It's like a 1-1 one, one board wipe. Blood Vassal. From Chippy! Aw, oh, thanks, Chippy! For this beautiful, beautiful illustration. Disenchant. <laughs> Not my thing. Cloak of Mists. Ooh. You can't see me. Cave Tiger. <laughs> this this is the most, like, magic-looking-ass card I've ever seen. This just looks straight up like a fucking magic card. Fiery Mantle. <laughs> Look at this smug bastard. <laughs> you like my mantle, don't you? Yeah, you fucking do. <laughs> Come on, man. Don't pretend you don't like my mantle. <laughs> we got that Argothian swine. <laughs> Those fucking tusks over here. Phyrexian ghoul. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. Ooh, lingering mirage. Beautiful. Thundering giant. Oh, God, I wish that were me. <laughs> just, just down here, just getting stepped on. Cathodian. Could you call over the Cathodian? I need you to clean up this mess. This the Cathodian. Alright. And Persecute. It's a four drop. Sorcery. Choose a color. Look at target player's hand. That color discards all cards. That player discards all cards of that chosen color. My finest warrior was lost to the Phyrexians. I pray that Lady Selenia died honorably. Radiant. Archangel. <laughs> wow. That's what I'm going to call, that's what I'm going to call my wife tonight. Radiant Archangel. Well, you know, not, not getting the amazing, uh, not getting the amazing pulls. We're doing okay. Haven't pulled a second Larry yet. I'm a little disappointed by that. Let's get a little Pokemon over here. Forward to the back. Venomous fangs. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> hey, what's up? <laughs> yeah, these fangs are venomous. <laughs> Back off, buddy. <laughs> hey, right. Little drifting meadow over here. Cycle lands. Arc lightning once again. We got that blood vassal. <laughs> Goblin patrol. <laughs> oh, I hate being a goblin. We got pestilence. Pestilence, baby. Damn, that's gross. Disruptive student. <laughs> He's doing little twirls with his finger. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Oh, this is Teferi. That's fucking Teferi. <laughs> Whoa. 
Wow! Teferi's a problem student. Always late for class. No appreciation for constructive use of time. That's beautiful. <laughs> I love it. There's that magic-ass magic. -ass magic. <laughs> you fucking like that mantle. Got that fertile ground, baby. Oh, shit. Is this a value card? Whenever enchanted land is tapped for mana, it produces an additional one mana of any color. Ooh. All right. That's got to be that's got to be some value there. Sanctum custodian. Got that destructive urge. That's beautiful. That shiny ass eye. <laughs> I'm feeling destructive. Victimize. I don't like that. Get that out of here. Veiled apparition. You know, I feel like the 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 uncommon and the rare symbol is like so close to each other. It's like so close. Wait, which one's good? Victimize is a good card. Oh, is it? All right. Okay, I'll keep it in the keep it in mind. Phyrexian Colossus. It's a seven drop, generic eight eight. Phyrexian Colossus does not untap during your untap phase. Pay eight life. Untap Phyrexian Colossus. Phyrexian Colossus cannot be blocked by fewer than three creatures. Doesn't doesn't seem that good. Is there some like combo that I? Oh, it is the pack image, huh? That's a silly card. Look at that. <laughs> Can you imagine? It looks like something from Chrono Trigger, kind of. You know what I mean? Like, and what's like up there? The moon. Fucking cool card, but dumb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool card. Dumb, but cool. All right. Let's get some Pokemon. Metroid Tree. That's a great one. Fortitude. A looming Shade. Carrion Beetles. <laughs> Looks like he's carrying that dude's eyeball, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. Uh, Rune of Protection, Black. Got oh, Jordan! Here comes Jordan! G-E-O! Din. <laughs> Din. There he is. There's the horseshoe crab we all know and love. Oh, beautiful. Little Jordan. That's a good sign. That's a good sign. That's a good sign we got something expensive. Classic little pacifism. Pouncing Jaguar. <laughs> He's like, oh, stop. <laughs> A nerve. Oh, Jesus. She's like, oh, shit. Uh, Rune of Protection, green. <laughs> I love her fucking sassy fit. Mm, you're not going to like this. I've got a Rune of Protection, green. All right. Power taint. <laughs> <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's what I yeah <laughs> I've always considered my taint to be quite powerful <laughs> absolute law over in the uncommons now mm. little Argothian elder untap two target lands oh that's wow that's really good that's got to be worth something. <laughs> Bereavement. I have no idea what's going on here. Is that some kind of creature? Ah, oh, poor creature. And attunement. Return attunement to owner's hand. Draw three cards, then choose and discard four cards. Well, that sucks. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's nice that you get to pick the cards, but like... A net card loss. Huh. Well, that's fine. No, it is great. Okay, fine. <laughs> There's still... You know, it's the card draw stuff that I don't, I don't really... I'm not super attuned with, you should say. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I guess it is net zero because of uh, you get a two-minute back in your hand. All right. Corrupt. Laser Boys. 
Pendril Flux. We got Priest of Titania. Uh, oh. Add, oh, dang, that's got to be good. That's got to be good. Oh, yeah, that is good. All right, I'm sleeping that. <laughs> I just read it, and I was like, oh, that's a, that's a big, that's a big mana source there. Okay, got it. <laughs> the sleeve, bring the sleeve in. Got that pouncing Jaguar. You got that Sarah Zealot with first strike. A 1-1 one, one with first strike. Psh. Fucking fervent champion all day. Unworthy dead. That's fucking cool. That's almost like a Seb. Seb artwork. <laughs> Look at power taint, dude. <laughs> Look at love that, dude. <laughs> Spire Owl. Little veiled serpent over here. Damn, that's a lot of words. It's like, stop writing so many words on the damn cards, dude. Wall of junk. I just took a picture of my house. Got that lifting refrain. <laughs> oh, shit. Hidden ancients. Hey, it's those fucking noodle trees again. They look fucking grumpy as hell, though. <laughs> it's because this dude's about to chop him down. He's like, are you seeing this shit? Yeah, I'm seeing it, dude. Yo, he's gonna fucking... He's gonna hit that X. He's like, yeah, I know. I'm, I'm, fuck, dude. All right. Gamble. So one drop. Search your library for a card. Put that card into your hand. Then discard a card at random. Shuffle your library afterwards. Oh, man. That's... That's tough. That's tough. It's like, yes, but. Wow. All right. Little gamble in your man. Oh, we got a lot of fucking... You know what? Let's open one more because this is the pack that KP said was the, was the cradle. So let's open one more and then go to Super Chats. Just to build the suspense, you know what I'm saying? I love this card. I'll show it to you in a second. It's fucking adorable. Whoop. We got a little healing salve. A little power sink. I had to get that installed after um, my beard hairs were clogging it up. Coral merfolk. A little bravado. <laughs> love his little swimsuit. <laughs> we're going swimming. You want to come? I'm not dressed for it, man. Aw, dude. Elvish Herder. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Target creature gains trample until end of turn. That's pretty dope. Uh, Viachino Weaponsmith. I guess the dinosaurs are the Viachinos. A little polluted mire. A little disciple of grace. A little annul. A little winding worm. <laughs> I do like to wind. Lay waste. Destroy target land. Oh, that's, that's fucking mean. Yes, look at him. <laughs> yeah! Oh my god, I love being a raptor. Wow! Ow! <laughs> or like, uh... Or like, he, uh... Somebody gave him a gift that was, like, very exciting for him. Little happy raptor. Dragon blood. This is my blood. Please don't take it from me. It is my blood. Smells nice. Got a little rune of protection artifacts. And here comes the rare. Metro gnome. <laughs> when a spell or ability one of your opponent's controls causes you to discard Metro Gnome. Put four Gnome tokens into play. Treat those tokens as 1-1 artifact creatures. <laughs> That's a little interesting. Metro Gnome. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right. <laughs> now let's do, some, let's do some super chats. Uh, damn, dude. Da -da 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 -da. LGS. Okay. Sturlson. 
Hey, Aaron, have you ever been interested in Yu-Gi-Oh? I am interested. Uh, Octopimp said he would teach me how to play, so I gotta hit him up for that. Jessica Semeca, uh, but is your hand stand, stained with the blood of man? Gasps in Spanish. No, it is stained with the blood of uh, uh, black walnuts. They are native and apparently protected in California. I'm not, I'm not super certain on that, but we have a ton around where we live, and they just, they just drop, and you can crack them open and eat them. Uh, Leona, Aaron, you remembered me. You're lovely. Tis I, Leona, yes. Uh, would you and Dan do another podcast? It was such a joy to hear you guys talk naturally. Uh, yeah, I, you know, I think that's probably pretty, pretty likely. Mm. Rusty Ralston. Uh, one more just to say, hey, trying to keep track of your thoughts but not managing it sucks. And B, I would love to go to St. Pierre at Mil uh, Mi Mikaelian, a small part of France off the coast of Newfoundland. Yeah, man. Any travel is good travel as far as I'm concerned. Uh, Bowtie So Fly Gaming. Glad I caught you live. Urza is one of my favorite blocks. Yeah, it's one of the most expensive ones. Um... It's a great block. Lots of power. Lots of power. Be locked down. Look up Rebecca Gay. Uh, oh, Rebecca Gay. Okay, that's how you pronounce it. Uh, Lands. The art is great. Okay, I'll look that up. Theeny Bean. Needed this chill stream today, dude. Thanks. Keep being a loving, positive person. Thanks, man. I'm glad you're enjoying it. It's just chill. You know, nothing special. Sean Myers. Hey, Aaron, I'm currently stuck in quarantine at Army Basic Training, and this is just what I needed to kill the isolation boredom. Stay awesome. Thanks, Sean. Um, thank you for your service as well. Well, I mean, I guess you're still training, but you will be giving service soon. Uh, so thank you for that. Cat Flail. Had a Goblin Land Destroy deck a long time ago. Love that thing. Cripple your opponents and unleash a swarm of gobbos. <laughs> I love the term gobbo. All right. Here we go. Uh, mm. So this KP, who has somewhat successfully called out packs previously in the past, some nice alliteration there, has guessed that this pack will be the pack with the cradle. So, <coughs> let's do this. Fortitude. Looming shade. Carrying that eyeball. Got a rune of protection. Oh, Jordan! Once again! Jordan! <laughs> Look at him! He's just a fucking horseshoe crab! Boom. Three Jordans in a row. Loving that Jordan, baby. Oh! Giordan! Goblin Spelunkers. We got the Pacifism, the Pouncing Jaguar, the Unnerve, the Rune of Protection. Uh -huh. And my favorite, the Power Taint. We got Titania's Boon. No rest for the wicked. Money don't grow on trees. All right. Got that Voice of Grace. And here comes the rare, Pariah. Not exactly the cradle. Redirect to enchanted creature all damage dealt to you. Huh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> I got bills to pay, I got mouths to feed. <laughs> Ain't nothing in this world for free. All right. Uh, let's just keep it going, man. It's not the it's not the cradle. It's not the cradle. But that's fine, you know, that's fine. Is force of will the most expensive non rare? Uh Pendril Flux. Oh, we got another Titania. Down for that. Sleeve that bad boy. Got some unworthy dead. Oh, say sacred. <laughs> hey, Amen. I'm the venomous fangs over here. A little arc light, a little pestilence, disruptive state. <laughs> Stern pro Proctor. Okay. Black Lotus isn't coming? No, it's not. <laughs> I 
Um, okay. Stern Proctor. We got Blasted Landscape. Yo, that landscape had a fucking rager last night. Uh, Guma? <laughs> is there a giant? Is it? Wait, okay. When the giant returned for the night, he found a dead merfolk on his pillow. Although he praised the little Guma, he inwardly wondered where she had hit the head. Is is Guma like a like a real thing? Endless worm. <laughs> He's like fucking <laughs> No shit. Dude, I haven't seen her in forever. It's a five drop with trample. During your upkeep, sacrifice an enchantment or sacrifice endless worm. It's a nine nine. That's some stompy shit right there. <laughs> she said, what? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, dude. <laughs> okay. Just leave that Titania, too. Fucking Guma over here. Fucking freaking me out. A little Guma action. Ah. Uh. <laughs> All right. Oh, I didn't even look at the, the front card, so that's good. Pokemon it up. Damn, getting a lot of healing. I love this, though. She's just like, don't you talk to him ever again. Power sink. <laughs> Too many beard hairs. Bravado, that elvish herder. Got that polluted mire. Gross. A null. Winding worm. Lay waste. Give me some value, baby. We're almost halfway through this box, and we haven't gotten, gotten much value. Scourge familiar. God, that is out of control. Ron Spencer's the one who draws the ones that are just, like, madness. Like, this is... If I had a nightmare about this, I would have. I would wake up and just be like, I never want to fall asleep again. Voice of Law. Very nice. And Sarah's Liturgy. That is not... That is not Sarah's Sanctum or whatever, yeah. This is Sarah's Liturgy. No big hits. No big hits yet. No big super hits. Well, throw it away. No Larrys, though. Yeah, we've only had one Larry so far. This pack has Cradle? All right. Let's give it the old Pokemon. Hollow dogs. Don't look like dogs. Look like creepy creatures. That look like creepy creatures. <laughs> Don't go down the book. All right. Search your library for the two forest cards. Reveal them. Put yeah, whatever. Opal gargoyle. Little duress. Let's leave that bad boy. Rewind. Yo, this just got reprinted. This is a. This is a. I don't understand why, why this card isn't more... Like, this is an incredible card. You get to... It's a, fr it's a free... It's a free cast. Right? Like, I don't, I don't understand why it's not just, like, awesome. Ah, uh, yeah, it costs four. Okay. Got it. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Opal carry added. Heat ray. <laughs> oh no, the nipple got me. Oh, the nipple got me in the nipple. Oh. We'll carry him. Telepathy. Each of your opponents play with his or her hand revealed. Oh, that's cool. Yo, that's got to be a good card, right? I'll throw that aside. Pit trap. Sorry, bro. Good trap and pit trap. Crosswinds. Life in the crosswinds. Midsummer Revel. Very colorful. Very colorful. Look at the pinks. Love the pinks. <laughs> That's where I want to be, man. Five drop. During your upkeep, you may put a verse counter on Midsummer Revel. Sacrifice Midsummer Revel and pay a green. Put X beast tokens into play where X is the number of verse counters on Midsummer Revel. Treat these tokens as three, three green creatures. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty, that's pretty badass. Gaia's Bounty is a hit. Really? 
Didn't seem that good. I'm gonna sleeve this duress as well. I love this guy's face, though. He's just like, the fuck is this shit? Uh. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, so far, this is like, this is not paying off. But you know what? It's all about the experience. As far as I'm concerned. Who, who gets to say, who gets to say that they opened up a full Urza Saga box? Goblin Patrol. A little Pestilence. Disruptive student, once again. <laughs> I'm Teferi. <laughs> Got a little protection blue. Oh, this one, she's like, mm, I guess it's not that great. Got that Pendril Drake. <laughs> Yo, he's, he's, dude, he's flexing. Like, you know, he's flying around, like, casual, but he's kind of like, yeah, but look at how jacked I am. Look at, look at me. Fertile ground. Little Sanctum Custodian. That dark, that dark, dark darkness. Scrap. I don't, it's just a, just a, oh, it's like a hammer. Little Rune of Protection White. Symbiosis. Two target creatures get plus two, plus two until end of turn. Eh. Eh. Gamble wasn't lost in the stack. Uh, Bog Raiders, Little Planner Void, Sanctum Guard. Whoa, that's cool. Donato Giancola. That's dope. Cool art. Fog Bank. <laughs> These fucking raptors. <laughs> oh, I can't see. Oh. <laughs> And Fluctuator. Cycling costs you up to two less to play. Oh, that's... Hey, man. That's useful. It's only a two drop. It's pretty useful. Uh, all right. Yeah, I'm getting, getting slammed. I'm getting taken to Pound Town over here. We need, some, we need some Larrys. We need some Larrys. Oh, Emmanuel Rivera showing up once again. Hey, Aaron, I've been watching back some of your power hours. It's always so relaxing and inspiring. You've really solidified my goal to save up money here overseas and pursue my voice acting dream when I get back to the States. You're awesome. Never forget that. Hey, man, thank you. Um, follow that dream, man. And uh, where are you? I mean, if you're at liberty to say overseas. But yeah, man. I'm, I'm glad to be a part of the, that, that path, your path, man. Oh, is Fluctuator expensive? Cool. Veiled Serpent. Little ravenous scourge. God, those things are so fucking gross. It's, this, it's like the vertical mouths. That's what really... The vertical mouths with, like, the normal eyes. It's, it's, it's weird. Congregate. Wow, very clean. Very clean art. Mark Zug. Mark Zuggerberg. A little good goblin patrol, a little Pendrel, <laughs> fucking jacked ass Drake. Got fertile ground. Got wizard mentoring anything. Got rejuvenate. A little wall of rune of protection. Goblin offensive. <laughs> I find these goblins offensive. Thran turbine. During your, this seems like it's good. During your upkeep, you may add up to two colorless mana to your mana pool. This mana cannot be spent to pay spells. Oh, so it's for, um... Yeah, it's for uh, activated abilities. Read the flavor text on offensive. They certainly are. <laughs> uh, that's great. Anaconda. It don't want none. Abyssal Horror. Oh, Fucking awesome. What the hell is going on? That rules. Six drop. Flying. When Abyssal Horror comes into play, target player chooses and discards two cards. That's all right. That's all right. It's all right. All right. Emmanuel Rivera. Oh, my God. Another Qatar. Oh, nice. I have never been to Qatar, and I really don't know much about it. 
Can you tell me the most beautiful thing about Qatar? You don't have to donate $100 when you do it. Just FYI. <laughs> you can just... You can just type in the chat or something. What's the coolest thing about Qatar? Oh, hold on. Uh, Joe. <laughs> Qatar got dope sand. <laughs> Elvish Lyrist. Got that Zealot, that Raider, Unworthy Dead. Ooh, Shower of Sparks. <laughs> this guy looks like he's like acting like he doesn't like it, but he's re like, oh no, the sparks. Oh gosh, I hate the sparks. Please stop. All right. Oh, Breach, this is new. It's fucking creepy as hell. Greg Staples. I'm gonna staple that in my brain. Ah, hey man, <laughs> venomous fangs over here. Jeez, <laughs> oh, watch out! I'll give you a bite. You got Sarah's embrace. I'll give you a little hug. Lifted beyond herself for that battle. Brindry was an angel of light and fury. Brindry. Right. Wait, who's Urza? Who's Urza? Oh, that's Urza. Got it. This is his saga, after all. Defensive formation. That's fucking cool. That's great. I love the, yeah, the, the, like the scratches, and this is so cool. Love that. Song of All. Is that their, like, Bible or whatever? Oh, Turnabout! Yes! That's one of the value cards. Woo! All right, cool. Yes, Turnabout. Bah! Four drop. Tap or untap all artifacts, creatures, or lands. Target player controls. That's a damn good card. Damn good, I say. Damn! And then what's what's the rare? Rumbling Crescendo. Five drop. During your upkeep, you may put a verse counter on Rumbling Crescendo. Sacrifice. Oh, is this like the Crescendo cycle? Destroy up to X target lands, where X is the number of verse counters on Rumbling Crescendo. Whoa. That's fucking mean. All right. Getting all the song cards. Uh, oh, excuse me. Oh, my goodness. Why are you putting the crab and Outrider on the side? Uh, listen. <laughs> listen, Reth Parish. Let me tell you a little something about, uh, about Jordan and Larry over here and Barry. They're good boys. All right? They're good boys. Oh, Emmanuel Rivera coming through. Okay, only fifty dollars this time. So if you're slipping, I'm kidding. Uh, Emmanuel Rivera, th thank you. I'm personally not a massive fan of Qatar. If I had to pick the most beautiful thing, it would be the city of Doha proper. The architecture is mind melting. Workers here literally moved inland sand into the sea to make more land. Nuts. Whoa. Okay, cool. I gotta look that up. Doha or Doha? I don't know how to pronounce it. All right. We got a little monk realist. <laughs> this guy posts on forums all the time. <laughs> Just fucking like, um, well, you know, I don't want to burst your bubble or anything. We got remote aisle. Little lull action. Little tree top rangers. Jumpity dumpity. Falter. Oh, these are all like new ones. I haven't seen a lot of these. Veil of birds. I'll take that shit. It's fucking cool. Those little sparrows. Lyrist, we got the Zealot, we got the, oh no, not the Shower of Sparks. Oh. You got that Breach. Fi oh, jeez, this is what living in Florida is like. Fire Ants. <laughs> Deals one damage to each creature without flying. Oh, shit, that's pretty good. Okay. Got that Blanchwood Armor. Ha <laughs> ha! Chanted creature gets plus X plus X, where X is the number of forests you control. That seems that seems pretty good. Yogmoth's edict. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out this picture here. It's just a bird that fell. Whenever one of your opponents successfully casts a white spell, that player loses one life and you gain one life. Oh, that's that's funny. There you go. Yeah, and Opal Archangel. It's not the fucking cradle. 
five drop when one of your opponents successfully casts a creature spell if opal archangel is an enchantment opal archangel becomes a five five creature with flying that counts as an angel attacking does not cause opal archangel to tap so she's got vigilance i love how they haven't come up with any of these any of these uh terms yet you know it's like oh there's this weird concept where like if you if you deal damage with a creature um you gain that damage back to your life total. Isn't that wild? I'm going to explain that on every card in full language. Oh, the bird was stuck in Phyrexian oil. Ah. <laughs> it's a fucking realist, dude. Well, if you actually watch the Avengers, you'll clearly see. Okay. Remote Isle, a little lull, a little opal carry added, heat ray, treetop, a little falter, corrupt. We got that Titania. Veil of Birds. All right. Opal Acrolith. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Don't go. Don't go. It, it, it's cool in here, right? It, it, it's cool. Academy Researchers. <laughs> so fucking... Did you hear what Larry said? Oh, Larry. Huh? Man of Leech. Very cool colors. And Dark Hatchling. Oh, same artist. Mark Nelson. Yeah, we're not seeing a whole lot of Larrys. That's that's the that's the issue, man. That's the issue. <laughs> man, what a leech. What is with you, man? Come on. I think that's why we're not getting the big hits right now, is because there's no Larry. We've seen so much more Jordan than Larry. Next pack has Yogmoth's will. Okay. All right. Make it happen. Got the headlong rush, little skittering scourge, little catalog. Hush. Hush, little bit. Oh, cool. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck. Shouldn't have fucked with a dinosaur. Get first strike. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's so it's fucking gross. <laughs> Ah, boy. <laughs> it's a good joke. Little launch. Enchanted <laughs> creature gains flying. <laughs> this art is fucking hilarious. Oh, that's funny. I love that. Befoul. These are all new, man. I've got I've got good feeling about this. I got a good feeling about this. <laughs> no. Silent attendant. Very beautiful. Oh, Rebecca Gay. That's why. I think I think I think Rebecca's my new fa Oh sign of good things to come. There's the boy. There's the boy. Oh, look at this fucking nice good boy. Let's sleeve this. Sleeve this. Beautiful man. Look at him. Ah, oh, look at him. <laughs> How old do you think Larry is? 300? 400? Beautiful Larry. <laughs> Slay you case it. <laughs> we got Urza's armor right here. Whenever a source deals damage to you, that damage is reduced by one. Okay, that okay. Little torch song. And a rain of filth. Oh, this is one of the good ones. Rain of filth. Let me look that up. Let me look that up real quick. Rain of filth. Rain of filth. Five bucks. One dollar at the least. All right. Lotus Blossom. Is that a is that a big boy? I don't think that's a big boy. No, that's not a big boy. That's a two dollar boy. Lotus Blossom two drop during your upkeep. You may put a petal counter on Lotus Blossom. Sack Lotus Blossom, add X mana of one color to your mana pool, where X is the number of petal counters. Play this ability as a mana source. Yeah, I could see. I could see that becoming useful. A little, little mana ramp. A little late game, mid game mana ramp. Put that rain of filth in there. All right, we need that cradle, man. We really need that cradle. Okay, here we go. Oh, da, 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 da. 
Hollow dogs. Could go for a hollow dog right now, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's like a hot dog thing. Guy's bounty. Someone said that's a hit. Is that a hit? Doesn't seem like it. Two forest cards, reveal them, put them into your hand. Shuffle your library afterwards. I mean, that seems like it sucks. I mean, you got circuitous route, which is one more expensive, and you actually put them on the battlefield. Opal Gargoyle. That's cool. You know what this looks like? This looks like the Ikoria alt art. You know what I'm saying? Like, very comic booky. Be foul. Silent attendance. Oh! Baby, baby! They were waiting till the end. We were waiting till the end for the fucking Larrys to hit. Oh, man. Now that's hot. Larry, congratulations. You've done it. You've done it. You're a beautiful boy. Everybody loves you. You're a summon lizard. They say they're frightened by dogs, but there are no dogs, not even little ones. Is the implication that they eat the dogs? Is that the implication? Oh, we got three Larrys now. Dude, we got... Hold on, hold on, hold on. This is, this is what's... All right. Let's, let's, let's do a little... Let's do a little, like, ritual here. We got Big Barry in the center. Sorry, Big Larry. We got... And then... We got Jordan. We've got Jordan. Jordan. And Jordan up here. All right, so this is going to help us... This is gonna help us with our polls, all right. So maybe, maybe this uh, this summoning formation of of the Larry and Jordans, and you can do a little. I may hiya, oh hiya, oh hiya, oh hiya, oh It's like some like witchy, witchy like incantation. I don't know. Oh, we got that duress. Let's leave that bad boy. Yep. I can't believe they reprinted this. This is so weird. Um, exhaustion. That's cool. I love these, like, these these people with, like, the tubes on them. Endoskeleton. Boy, that's, uh, that's gross as hell. A little disorder action. <laughs> Pegasus is like, let's get the fuck out of here! Oh, shit! There we go. Hold on. I'm gonna sleeve the shit out of that. Fucking jo Jordan and Larry, they did it! They did it! It was the ritual! They did it! Oh! Gilded fucking Drake, baby. Here it is. 3-3 three, three flyer. 2-drop. When Gilded Drake comes into play, exchange control of Gilded Drake for target one of your opponent's c controls... For target creature, one of your opponent's controls and sacrifice Gilded Drake. Or sacrifice. Fire beware. Okay. <laughs> really fucked up that, uh... But still. Got the fucking Drake, baby. Oh! Yeah, that's sick. That's fucking sick. I guess you put that, put that in the hard case. Damn, dude. I mean, how much is it actually selling for? Because I'm looking at, you know, I'm looking at TCG Player and I'm seeing, you know, the market price... 172 the buy list price is like 50 bucks so i think yeah i think now that we have this this uh larry jordan formation jo jordan jordan versus larry larry bird versus michael jordan that's what's going on here this is happening all right polluted mire Baby, oh, look at this! Look at Larry. Just add him to the add him to the situation, dude. We got that full Larry playset. Now that's sick. This is fucking sick, dude. And we got that duress straight away. Oh, we're getting the polls now. We're getting the polls. Got that duress right in there. Hmm. Larry's bringing the good stuff right now. Larry is bringing the good stuff. Are we going to get a fourth Jordan? I'm hoping we get a fourth Jordan. Got that heat ray. Got the carry-on beetles. The rune of protection. Rain of salt, dude. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. It's fucking raining salt out. Got that albino troll. He, don't look at me. 
Seasoned Marshall. And what do we have after this? Sunder! Return all lands to owner's hands. That's fucked up. <laughs> That's fucked up. That's a fuck you card if ever there was one. It's like, fuck it, we're doing it over again. Suck my dick. <laughs> Sunder. Jesus. Band and Commander? Sunder's Band and Commander? Wow. Yeah, that makes sense. It's such an asshole card. Like, nobody nobody wants to use or get hit by Sunder. Like, that's such a... Such a bummer. Alright. Four cards. The Rangers. The Halo. Get that hidden spider. Oh, no. The Study. The Scourge. Me after Taco Bell. Headlong Rush. Cradle Guard. Oh, is that a good sign? Is that a good sign? I'm thinking that's a good sign. Wow, look at that. Is that her? No, it's D. Alexander Gregory. That's a fucking sick card. That is really cool. Oh, it's a wall. More dance. Damn, buff as hell. <laughs> Don't look at my body. But please do it anyway. <laughs> and we got Contamination as the rare. Okay, fine. During your upkeep, three drop. During your upkeep, sacrifice a creature, sacrifice contamination. Whenever a land is tapped for mana, it produces. Uh, black mana instead of its normal type and amount. Interesting. Contaminated. Oh, that's a hit, huh? Oh, shit, it is. 24 bucks. All right. Hey, all right. That's a legal FU commander card. That's so fucking cruel. Mmm. I uh, got a little water up my nose. Man, we're down to the last stack, man. I mean, we did get the fucking... We did get the fucking... Uh, uh, the Larrys and the Jordans over here. But not the... Uh, not the Cradle. Let's see what we can do. Got that rune... The Rush, the Scourge, the Hush, <laughs> the Peace, the Runner, the Fiend, the Launch, the Bounty, the Attendant, the Voltaic Key. Oh, is this one of those sculptures? So cool. Titania's Chosen. He's got a nice ass. Presence of the Master and Phyrexian Processor. Is that one of the hits? No. Phyrexian Processor, four drop. When Phyrexian Processor comes into play, play any amount of life. Pay any amount of life. Put a minion token into play. Treat this token as a black creature with power and toughness, each equal to the amount of life paid at the time Phyrexian Processor came into play. Oh, that's interesting. That's interesting. Okay. Come on. Come on. We need the cradle. We need the cradle, baby. I'm really hoping for the cradle. Seems kind of cool that they put the uncommons right up front so that they can get all scarred up by the, the wrapping or whatever. Okay, wild dogs. Disciple, catalog... Got the reflexes and the winds and the ritual and the fucking guy. Oh, here we go. All right, number three. Number three. We got Barry over here. We got Larry and we got Barry. Let's throw him over here with his friends. Redeem. Jagged Lightning. <laughs> what is this, a fucking Looney Tunes cartoon? There's a Bugs Bunny over here. <laughs> it's a rabbit season. Priest of Gix and... Angelic Chorus. Whenever a creature comes into play under your control, gain life equal to that creature's toughness. Still not 
the cradle. Let's leave the key. How much is that key? Getting some good key action going on here. We'll take a key. Hey, man. I'll take that. Sleeve the key! It's a hit! Oh, it's just like the, um... The key. <laughs> the manifold key. <laughs> uh. right, let's get this MF show on the road, man. Where's that fucking cradle? Is it here? Is it here? A little buggy. Sparks. Gross. Okay, Order of Yogmoth. Is that a hit? That can't be a hit. That's not a hit. Arcane Laboratory. <laughs> this fucking guy. Oh, is that Karn back there? Oh, I thought that was... I thought the, the, like, the dark part in the center of his face was like his teeth. And he was like, ha, 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 ha. Oh, you don't know what you're doing, do you? Got the Cathodian. Yeah, we got the Cathodian. And Antagonism. <laughs> Antagonism. Antagonism. What the fuck is wrong with me, dude? <laughs> Antagonism. <laughs> <laughs> what's a what's an antigo? Uh, it's a four drop during each player's discard phase. Antagonism deals two damage to that player unless one of his or her opponents was successfully dealt damage that turn. Okay, antagonism, baby. Look at the look at this look at this. We got the gilded Drake, but like we're at eight left. You know what? Maybe KP when he said. 8th from now, he meant 8th from the end. So this would be 8th from the end. And maybe this is the cradle. This is it. It's happening. Here comes the cradle. Here comes the cradle. Got a little tree folk. A little reflexes. Got that page. The Telerian winds. The foul. Yeah. Oh, we got Barry. Oh, we got Barry. We got a full play set of berries over here. All right, we got Outmaneuver. Reclusive White. During your upkeep, if you control any of us. It's gross. It's gross. We got that refrain. Here's the cradle. Oh, shit. Okay. That's not the cradle, but, uh, <laughs> I'll tell what is it, the second most valuable card? No, 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 it's, like, the fifth. But fuck, man. This card's, like, banned in, like, most formats, right? Holy shit, that's awesome. All right. Good hit. Good hit. <laughs> Pog, Pog, motherfucker. We did, ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Look at that. Beautiful. So cool. Such weird art. All right, all right, all right, all right. Maybe we're in the clump zone now. Maybe we're in the clump zone. You know? Maybe now it's just fucking Cradle, Sanctum, Yogmoth. Just one after another. That's what I'm hoping for. The Spelunkers, the Gorilla, Unnerve... Let's get to those uncommons. Sandbar Serpent. Just a regular serpent. Guy has embrace. <laughs> Sexy. God, what a creature. Season Marshal. And here's the cradle. Morphling! Oh, shit! That's up there. Isn't that up there? Oh, it's like seven bucks. Okay. That's a good card, though. Morphling, five, five drop. You can pay to untap it. Morphling gains flying. Cannot be the target of spells. Oh, it gets hexproof. 
plus one minus one or minus one plus one. So lots of lots of sneaky little abilities. It's a three three. It's very cool. Very cool card. All the lings are pretty dope. Well, that is nice. Oh, if I open from the bottom, they got that that sick uh, sick little slit to help them rip better. I don't know what I'm talking about over here. All right. Exhum, the Charger, we got Curfew, the Matron, Crater, Wild Dogs, Expunge. All right. Clear. Very cool. Mobile Fort. That's new. Oh, it's a wall. Okay. Walls can't attack. Parasitic Bond. Cool. Love the, like, the color blocking. So cool. And reprocess. Not on the list. Not on the list. Four drop. Sacrifice any number of artifacts, creatures, and or lands, and draw a card for each one sacrificed this way. Eh, there's a black card draw. It's like a really expensive... Uh, they just released uh, Village Rights. Great card. Love that card. All right, this is the one. Everyone's saying this is it. I'm feeling it too, man. I'm feeling that uh, that positive energy. Let's flatten it out so we don't get a little sneak peek. All right. Got that expunge, the mire. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Just right. Oh, 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 oh. This is a good sign. This is a good sign. We got the full play set. This rounds out all of the play sets. We got four Jordans, four Larrys, four Berries. I'm, th this has got to be it. This has got to be it, you guys. This is 100% it. Look at this. Look at this. Four Jordans, four Larrys, and four Berries. Oh, you can't see, you can't see the Berries over here. There's four berries over here. Dude, 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 dude. Here it is. This is it. This is it. Sanguine Guard, nobody cares. A little douse, is that good? I don't know. Who cares? Bull Hippo, fucking love this guy. Look at him. Go bowling on Saturdays. Here it is. Here's the cradle. Energy field. Energy field. Fucking energy field? Energy field? Fucking energy field? Energy field? All right. That's what we got to do. You're right. You know what? Y'all are right. First of all, I got to sleeve this berry. Oh, there's two berries that are not sleeved. Got to sleeve this berry. Got to sleeve this berry. Got to got to put him in the got to put him in the uh, in the in the got to put him in the in the situation here. There. All right. Now we've got a real summoning. It's a bit of a mess, isn't it? Yeah. Now we've got a real summoning situation going on there. All right. Four more packs, and I gotta tell you, the cradle's coming. There is no denying that the cradle is coming. One, two, three, four. There it is. Spire Owl, Retromancer. Ain't getting nothing from this shit. Hidden Gorillas. Sarah's him. Meltdown. Baron's Codex. Who the fuck gives a fuck about Baron and his goddamn Codex? Nobody gives a fuck 
about Baron and his stupid fucking codex. Suck my smelly dick, Baron, and your dumbass fucking codex. During your upkeep, you may put a page counter on Baron's codex. You can pay four and tap and sack. Draw X cards where X is the number of page counters on Baron's codex. Fuck you, Baron. Fuck you. Suck my dick. Fucking Baron, motherfucker. Sucking ass. Sucking ass and smelling shit. Where's the fucking cradle? Where's the goddamn cradle? Cave tiger. Scrap and exhume and symbiosis. And nobody cares. Nobody cares about any of this shit. Steam blast. The worn power stone. Uh, two colorless mana to your mana pool. It's like a soul ring, but like less good. Got that peregrine Drake. That's the fucking smug Drake again, dude. All right. Wait, what's the hit? Power Stone's a hit. All right, I'll sleep that. Ark. <laughs> Who the fuck is Ark? Ah oh, cannot attack unless a creature with greater power also attacks. Ah oh, cannot block unless a creature with greater power also blocks. Fucking ah! Oh. Unfucking believable, dude. I didn't even know Ah was a thing. That shit looked like it didn't, it, like it didn't exist, like it wasn't real. Like Ah, what is Ah? Oh, I didn't sleeve the. This is why I didn't sleeve any of the Jordans, dude. I didn't sleeve any of the fucking Jordans. What am I doing, man? These fucking Jordans are sitting here unsleeved. Unprotected from the wilderness. I'm freaking out over here, man. I can't take it. All right. Here, let's, let's, let's do a little... Fucking awk. Suck my dick, awk. Fucking awk. Give me a break, dude. All right. Here it comes. Here's the cradle. Okay. Here's the cradle. This is the pack with the cradle in it. So I've been told. So I have been told. Fecundity! I don't know what that is. Flesh Reaver. <laughs> Just woke up with that at the end of my bed. Hey, Frank. Whoa, that's dope. Song Stitcher. The fucking purple against that, like... That looks like a modern card. <laughs> hey, <laughs> look who did it. Barry. <laughs> this is fucking this guy. All right, here was the cradle. Fucking Bedlam. I don't even know what the fuck Bedlam means. Ah, Jesus. Four drop creatures cannot block. Suck my dick. Suck my dick. Last pack. Sarah, give me something. Give me something. I swear to God. <sighs> there it is. There's a the cradle. Get used to it. <laughs> Fucking little guy. All right. Hawk eater moth. That's terrifying. Humble. Hashtag humble brag. All right. All right. All right. Here it is. Here comes the cradle. Yeah, it's a seven drop. Uh, power and toughness is equal to your life total. Sarah Avatar is put in the graveyard. Shuffle Sarah. Yeah. So enjoy that. 
Well, you know what? This is what really matters right here in front of us. This is what really matters. This is life. This is life. This is what we really need to protect ourselves, to... I'm gonna carry... I'm gonna get one of those um, hard cases that carries, like, fucking ten cards or whatever that are made for, like, the super thick baseball cards. And, uh... And just carry these all around. Carry these in my wallet. And just take them out whenever I need some... Need, need some love. Need some Dromosaur love. <laughs> for those of you who want to see... Uh... A cradle. I do have one here. Uh, let me find it. Go through my hard cases. There you go. This is what we did not. This is what we did not get. The Cradle. This one's perfect. This one's a little busted up. Did not get the Cradle. But you know what? That's okay. This is Dan's Cradle, yes. This, this is... Dan has two guys' Cradles. He claims to have bought at least one of them for $3. So there you go. <sighs> you know what? But you know what? Hey. We had fun. This is a good time. No, I got some, got some sick Larrys, got some sick Jordans. Oh, and we got a lot of good Commander cards. But we're not done yet. Let's go through some, um, let's go through some uh, Super Chats. And then uh, how about we do a little, uh, uh, who's my what's it? A little, one of these, one of these bad boys. Uh, all right. Oh, jeez. Wow, this goes way back. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Sean Myers, thank you. Hey, Aaron, I'm currently stuck in quarantine at... Uh, oh, right, I got you already. Swarm of gobbos, definitely. Okay, Peter Went. Aaron, equip a Viridian longbow on that horseshoe crab and it becomes a freaking machine gun. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> Freaking machine gun. Uh, Curtis B. Hello, good sir. I have just finished a Game Grum Zelda marathon. Would you ever consider playing Minish Cap? I would. Good luck on your polls. May the almighty brushwag bless you upon a guy's... Bless upon you a guy's cradle. Thank you so much. Love that little brush boy. Um, got that Emmanuel Rivera. Thank you so much for that. Kai White. I had a dream where I woke up and watched a Game Grumps Minecraft episode. It was so fun. Anyway, I can't wait for more 51 Clubhouse. It is my favorite series. There is definitely more Clubhouse coming your way. We finally got it working again, so everything is A-OK. -okay. Uh, Jana LaCava, welcome back. Hey, Aaron, was curious if you ever heard of the Kingdom Hearts card game. Also, was so happy the Video Game Boy shirt is back in stock. Finally was able to order one. Thanks, Big Cat. Uh, I did not know there was a Kingdom Hearts card game, and I'm way, way interested in that. That is awesome. Um, Nuttable Face, GG. Hey, Aaron, you probably remember me. You liked my name before. <laughs> yeah, I like your name now. I love you, buddy. Keep doing amazing things. You too, man. Uh, KP, once again, hey, Aaron. Psst, Aaron, power taint. I <laughs> uh, love that power taint. Fucking love it. Uh, Will Lee Brad. These streams got me into magic, dude. I bought a Japanese War of the Spark Box, hoping I managed to pull an alt art Liliana. Oh, yes, I know. Love what you do. It's a beautiful card. New Age Renegade. Uh, Aaron, I want to thank you for pulling me out of my depression on multiple occasions and inspiring me to start my channel. First dono feels good. Thank you, man. I'm so glad that you're out of that depression, man. Um, Life in Gaming. Eagle Raptor pulled a reverse Nintendo, started with gaming stuff, and turned into cards. You know what? I'm just I'm just following the, the love, man. I'm just following the love. I love the cards. I love the games. I'm sure there'll be something else after this. Yukikaze, 617. I just remembered sound clip of you reading a Naruto fan story on Shizy Art. Wondered if you remembered it too. Oh, do I? Mm. Might have just been something I was make, making up. Seisuke! I remember that stuff. Leona, I know you've talked about what to do as a new voice actor, but any things to avoid? 
Always wanted to voice act, but I was told it was hard because no experience and I'm a woman, so I should give up. Oh, fuck that. Uh, any things to avoid? Um, don't do Kermit the Frog impressions. <laughs> so everybody does that. Uh, any things to avoid? Avoid bad people? Always, uh, I don't know, put yourself out there. Um, make a demo minute and a half. Um, always make sure that if you're looking for work, people know, people have it, like, right? So, so like, sometimes I'll get emails from people, well, I used to get emails from people that were like, hey, uh, um, like, sorry, I lost my train of thought. Um, yeah, I get emails from people that are like, hey, do you need new voices? And I'm like, I, I, I don't know. Like I, I can't hear your work. Like so, always have your demo on hand if you're emailing or like reaching out to somebody. Always be like, "Here's my fucking demo. Listen to it." Um. Uh, but don't give up. No, that's ridiculous. Uh, Nutable fate. GG. Love supporting you guys whenever you stream. I'm gonna go now. Love you, Aaron. Hope the rest of your packs go amazing. Be safe, buddy. Everyone, be safe. You heard it from Nutable Face. Everyone, be safe. Um, KP, praise be the ritual. The oh, I know, it's it. Praise be, but didn't get that cradle. Got the got the academy though, and got the gilded Drake. Those are some pretty big hits, so I'm pretty happy about that. The Mobius stripper magic is great, but have you tried D and D? Five E is dope. Um, yeah, it's okay. You know, I'm not a huge fan, but I get the appeal. Uh, Levy Jones, hey, could you play more tricky towers? That was fun. I would love to play that again. Um, Germ Noble, uh, BW is the best cover combo. Changed my mind. Oh, uh, Azorius. Yeah, I, you know, I love, um, I've got some good, uh, sack decks. Uh, what are they called? Aristocrat decks. Uh, I, I do love, uh, uh, no, Azorius. Fucking Orzov. Duh. Goddamn. Orzov. Jesus. Uh, yes. Orzov is great. Um, Scrub Lord. Hey, Aaron, do you know what a cube is? Yes. I do. I've always wanted to build a cube. Always wanted to build a cube. Um, I think it's the dopest shit in the world. I think it's such a cool idea. But I only learned about it since... Uh, uh, the quarantine. So, sorry, I'm like, I'm like going in and out of being brain dead. Uh, Levy Jones, did you find MTG from The Odd Ones Out? Uh, no. I, I found MTG because... Well, all my friends used to play it when I was a kid, but um, I got back into it because of that brand deal that we did for the 10 minute power hour, we played it in the pool. Um, but I was on tour with the odd ones out, and he was like, Hey, so I heard you're getting into magic. And I was like, Um, yes. And then we just like played magic the entire time we were on tour, which is awesome. Um, and then also, uh, one of our tech guys, Alex, um, was also into magic. So we just had these, it was, it was awesome. It was great. Droid person. The Sonic Heroes finale was hysterical. Uh, thank you. Thanks so much for playing it and making me realize that my favorite childhood game is an absolute dumpster fire. <laughs> well, you know, try not to be super negative about it, but... Uh, okay. Just doing a little moderating. <laughs> Uh, Pete Wodge looks like you need a second box because that was a dud yep looks like I'm going to have to order a second box so here we go second Urza Saga box <laughs> uh, Marcos you did ask Sarah to give you something good so I mean she really delivered really she delivered when you think about it also what MTG color identity are the grumps uh, I do like a lot of like black white black white red Mardu um I, I, I shy away from blue the most. I don't do a whole lot of blue. I like creatures. Um, I like straightforward shit. Uh, Pete Wodge. Again, also hopefully that collector's box has some foil Grim Tutors. Mine gave me one, so here is for hoping. Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, Barakius, can you please sing Smash Mouth All-Star in the Grubber voice? Also look at MTG artist Dan Scott, including my favorite card, Acroma's Memorial. Um... 
Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on, go play. Let me tell you something. Uh, Cat Flail, thank you. Ever thought of doing 40k kill team for Power Hour? I don't know what that means, but... I... Hey, why not? Uh... Okay. Great. Oh, shit! Potato Whiskers! Holy fuck! Hey, Aaron, I just started watching your streams. I've been playing Magic for a few years, and your appreciation for the cards and art makes me so happy. You've inspired me countless times to keep on going in life. Sending love your way. Thanks, bud. Sending love your way. Again, thanks for that. All right. Let's do this collector's box and then get on with our fucking Sundays. Shh. Open this bad boy. I fucking hate Ugin. I'm so sick of him, dude. Every time, like, the game is going well and I'm like, dude, this is awesome. You know, they got a ton of mana, but, like, not much is happening for them. And I'm just, like, cleaning up. And then they play the Ugin and it's like, so I guess I lose. Mm. Hate that card. I see that's a fairy borderless. That's right. These packs are just so fucking so neat. Like look at how fucking like just clean silver. Awesome. Alright. Boogan the Boogan. Let's do this, baby. We got a sapperling. Oh, right. <laughs> I, I, I forget. <laughs> I keep forgetting that. Uh, the battlements. The wish coin crab. Run afoul. <laughs> yeah. Little pitch burn devils. I love eliminate. Great card. Great early game removal. All right. Here come the big boys. Ready for this? Stormwing entity. Great for drafts. Pursued Whale Foil. Love this Moby Dick card. Just great fucking flavor on that Moby Dick card. That's awesome. And here we go with that box. Okay, okay. I've already opened one of these these uh, collectors. Almost every single pack had a full art foil. Are they just like handing them out now? I mean, this is this is ridiculous. Got Basri's Solidarity, Basri's Acolyte, and Basri's Lieutenant. Wow, that's a Basri pack if ever there was one. Uh, we got Garut. You know what? Let me put the non foils over here. Garut's Gorehorn, and of course, the token. Lots more box toppers. I <laughs> love how weird that Gorehorn looks. Yeah, it's it's fucking it's fucking it's a grimy ass creature. Like, it's just, it's just, I've got go I've got horns everywhere. Any any which way you look at it, like if he wants a hug, it's like, oh, sorry, I'm the Gorehorn though. I can't hug. All right, Jungle Hollow got that masked. Oh, there's that rambunctious mutt. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh no, he's got my shit. <laughs> he got his shit. Is that like is that some kind of artifact that's like really powerful or something that he's got in his mouth? I love the truffle snout. I'm not gonna lie, I fucking love the truffle snout. Look at this guy. This little fucking hair there. Look at this fucking guy. <laughs> Look at how fucking proud he is. Mm-hmm. I'm a truffle snout. Don't look at me, none. I'm just carrying some mushrooms. And see you later. Little Tide Skimmer. Volcanic Geyser. Also good for drafting. Ooh. Got that full art Ori. Beautiful. I love that Vulcan Baga art. Which, by the way, is the coolest name in the world. Vulcan Baga. Like, come on. It's fucking awesome. Necromentia. Necromentia. You'll never be able to necro me. Oh, Vito. Love Vito. Love Vito. The moment he came out, I was like, fuck yeah, Vito. Uh, when you gain life, target opponent loses that much life. So good, man. That's so much fun. Um, I built a, Gar a Gary deck with Vito. It's just like, just a double fuck you. Little Teferi's protege. And we got that containment priest. I have three of these. <laughs> this full art containment priest. This seems to be the, the, the rare, the full art rare that they're just like, yep. Yeah. 
Just take it. Just take it. We got that Garouk's point. Oh, and a foil Basri. Basri's lieutenant. Beautiful. And the soldier. Oh, what's on the other side? A cat. They all have that fucking line, that printer line. Look at that. They all have it. Ever since Eldraine, they've always had that. Annoying. See, look. Check this out. Cat. It's got it. It's got the line. They all have the fucking line. I don't know what the deal is with that. I think it may be how they seal it now. Waker of Waves, so good for drafts. I've I I um I went seven and zero because of Waker of Waves in, in drafts. That was awesome. And here we go. Subira Tolzidi Caravaner. Very nice, beautiful. Oh, I love the elephants. <laughs> this fucking elephant smiling ear to ear, dude. Look at him. <laughs> He's just like I fucking love being an elephant, dude. All right. Conspicuous Snoop. Haven't used him yet, but he seems... That seems fun. To, to build a goblin deck, that that sounds fun. Heroic Intervention. Very cool. This card. Fuck this card. I, I don't see it used a whole lot, but, like, when it is used, it's like, this shit is so fucking strong. It's not quite, um... It's not quite, uh... Uh... The... What the fuck? The flying one. The one that's like 1-3 and it gets plus 2, plus 2. It's, it's the same as this, but it doesn't get double strike. Got that Gorehorn non-foil. Got that Harbinger. Fucking nice. Little Chandra's Magma foil. Little Basri Solidarity. They're, they're passing out these Basri uh, cards, I, I gotta say. And that was the cat. All right. Yeah, Chandra Spitfire, that's the one. Doesn't seem to be... because a, a, I mean, a flyer that, that pumps is ridiculous. Turn to Slag, great for drafts once again. Got that Foil Mountain, very nice. All right, here we go. Transmogrify. I always thought this... I, I read that... Okay, so Exile Target Creature, that creature's controller reveals cards from the top of their library until they reveal a creature card. That player puts that card onto the battlefield then shuffles the rest into their library. That seems pretty fucking good, right? Like, uh, I don't know. Ooh. I, th this is trouble. This, this card's trouble for me. Like, I really, I'm really not a fan of this guy. I, I mean, if I used him, I'd probably be a fan of him, but every time he shows up, I'm like, oh, motherfucker. God damn it. This fucking sucks. Are, are you kidding me? Two full art foils in one pack? That's amazing. What the fuck? That Pursued Whale, by the way, that's dope. The foiling on the scars. That's so cool. Wow. Oh, I'll fucking take that. Oh, here we go. Here we go, baby. Non-foil, but full art to fairy. That is sick. That is fucking sick right there. Very, very nice. And we got the foils. And that bird. With the sapperling. Woo! All right. Little foil forest. Little garuk. Finishing blur. See, this feels a little more like traditional magic art, you know? Like, it's a little weird. It's not quite, like, super realism. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm into this. I, I hope they do more of that. I hope they sort of go back to, like, varied art styles. Because it has gotten a little homogenous lately. All right, here we go. The temple. Always useful. I always, I always slot two of them in, in my deck. Terror of the Peaks. This card is a fucking nightmare. Every time I see this card, I'm like, I. Uh, it's like, um. It, it gives me the kind of vibes that, like, uh, Agent of Treachery gives me, where it's just like, fuck. Fuck this card. Fuck. <laughs> All right. Hey, oh, wow. Foil Fabled Passage. Is this still, like, a pretty valuable card, like it was in Eldraine, or did the price go down because it got pre printed? 
Uh, we got the tutelage, the acolyte. Got that. Um, I'm sure this is going to be in a uh, planeswalker deck. Got the foil tutelage. Ooh, the foil incinerator. People keep saying this card's going to be good, but uh, I don't. Uh, not a huge. I haven't seen it a lot, you know? All right. Halfway through. Here we go. Here we go, you bad boys. The spined megalodon. The ornery dilophosaur. <laughs> yeah! I love it. Oh, Goblin Wizard. He's so good in drafts. Uh, Shipwreck Dowser, Little Tavern Swindler. All right, here we go. Boom, Full Art Temple. Once again, always useful. See the truth? I have seen this card used a lot. Have seen it used a lot. The Full Art Sanctum of All Foil. I'm telling you, man. They're just fucking handing out these fucking Full Art Foils. Wow, that foiling is amazing. Holy shit. It's like an illusion. Wow, that's dope. Alright. Oh, here we go. Full art. Sad robot. Nice. Oh, how, yeah, I gotta build a shrine deck. That sounds so much fun. I haven't tried it yet. Gotta try it with the Hondens. Uh, there we go. The tutelage. And dog. 1-1 one, one dog. Who's on the other side? Whoops. Griffin! Oh, that Griffin Airy. That's such a fucking fun card. It's not, like, the most amazing, but... Whenever you get that shit online, it's like, Hey, I'm making griffins left and right, motherfucker! Alright. The forest, the shrine, the mauler. This just... You know you know what it's like... I studied the blade or whatever. You know, where it's like the pictures of the people, and it has, like, a picture of them in the background, and their heads big, and it's kind of faded out. Like, this is what... This is what this card feels like. It's like, I'm Liliana Savoti. Um, I'm 28. Uh, I work out. Um, you know, I, I work at Jamba Juice. All right. Ooh, the temple in every pack. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. The most fuck you card ever. Aside from fucking casualties of war. God, this is... This is, this is one of those, man. This is one of those. Hey, another foil Azusa. I have a couple of these. This is great. Very good. Basri's Acolyte, who gives a fuck. Got the Harbinger. Got that foil Devotee. And a full art foil Scavenging Ooze. So sick of this bad boy. I have a fucking... Um, um, the, the Everwise. The... the is that deck where it's like everything depends on like the sorceries and the instants that are in your graveyard. This guy sucks against that deck. I hate going against that fucking creature when I'm in that deck. I'm using that deck. Um, <laughs> Scoozy boy. A little scooz. Yeah, just a little scooz. All right. We got five more to go. So let's just crack them open. Let's see what we got going on here. The rugged highlands, little man rot. The rain of revelation. That's that's really nice. It's really pretty. This guy, this guy is outrageous. This shit's outrageous. I've seen him showing up more and more in games. That's a fucking outrageous card. Definitely like if you can get like a like a Selesnia deck with like you know, like a Johnny's Pride mate, and then this guy, like, pff, forget it, man. Got another Pursued Whale. Whoops. I'll take a Pursued Whale any day. Ooh, full art foil in the Ombi. That's that Teferi's kid, yeah? That's what they taught me on the last stream. <laughs> uh, Ombi Esteem Speaker. Beautiful. Uh, look at this. Look at this. Look, look at this. Two full art foil. That's ridiculous. What the fuck? This is, this is absurd. 
Ugh. All right. Lily. Oh, here we go. Fucking beautiful Lily. You know, I got. I, I actually kind of like this art more than the the alt art. I'm not gonna lie. It's just. It's. It, there's something very sweet about it. She's just kind of hanging out in a graveyard, just being a normal girl. Very cute. Garuk's Gorehorn and Garuk's Uprising. And dog. Can't forget dog. All right. Scorching Dragonfire. Great reprint. Love that card. Ah, oh, Village Rights. This fucking changed everything for those fucking sack decks, man. Like, this card kicks ass. Love everything. Love everything. Love this card. Season high, little blade, little battle rattle. Little battle rattle. Battle rattle time. Glorious Anthem. Uh, is this card good, man? Uh, it's it's one of those cards where it's like... It's like, that sounds good. It's just a three drop and everybody gets 1-1. One, one. It's fucking great. It's not like color dependent. Ooh, Foil Sanctum Vol. Actually, looks a little different than the the real Sanctum of All or the the the, the full art one, and a full art. No, not regular. Just a foil, solemn, simulcrum, sad robot, sad robot, baby. Got that Chandra's incinerator. Very cool. All right, it's a six drop, six six. This spell costs X less to cast, where X is the total amount of non-combat damage dealt to your opponent's this turn. So it's like you put this in a fucking cavalcade deck, and it's just like, oh, it's a one drop. Six six with trample. And then it doubles the amount of like this is a ridiculous card. This is a ridiculous card. And you got that Pyrelang and hey, little Basri. He's cool. They did those uh, special decks on Arena where um, uh, it was just the pre-made Planeswalkers decks that were mono mono colored. And I, my Basri was my favorite. Just all about beefing those boys. Little island. Little turret ogre. Here we go. Boom. Baron. Full art Baron. He's got that lightning behind him, but he doesn't give a shit. He's like, I'm too powerful to worry about that shit. Did you? Is there people photobombing me back here? What the fuck? This is supposed to be my portrait. A little foil transmogrify. Foil Bane Slayer Angel. I like to throw this in as uh, as like a little win con for for like white white decks. Just just like <clears throat> there you go. Full art scavenger goose. Beautiful. Foil to fairy. I still don't know what the order is on this. It's like uh, it's like full art and then one random rare. I don't know. I felt like Eldraine was like very clear about like you get three premier art and then you get the rare and then you get the whatever. Oh, I'll sleeve them afterwards. There's way too many to sleeve, so I'm just I'm just slamming through them. Double vision. Fucking every time this shows up, I get worried. It's pretty expensive though for for red deck. Azri's Lieutenant. Full art foil, Demonic Embrace. Love the art in this. It's a Sidharth, right? Yeah. Fucking great. Great art. Love that foot. Oh, whoops. I'm not, I'm not a foot guy, but like... <laughs> there's just something about like the way it's shaded. It's very like... Like you can see the shape of it really well. <laughs> now to start all the... Aaron has a foot fetish. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Let's get off that topic and go straight into the Grim Tutor, baby. Oh, yeah. Loving this. That's a good hit. Don't have the foil one yet, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see if it happens in the next one pack. <laughs> Yo. All right. 
Concordia Pegasus. We got that Protégé, the Portcullis Vine. Come on, what do we want to see? We want to see Hooded Blightfang. We want to see the fucking Death Touch deck. We want to see the fucking Golgari Death Touch deck. Moss Viper, a little... Uh, uh, other ones. Primal Might. Teferi's Ageless Insight, not the alt art. Little Chandra. Oh, here we go. Full Art Cultivate. Quite beautiful. Love this art. It's weird that this is the only full art rare that's, like, not a rare card. Holy shit. <laughs> okay. All right. That's the first time I've seen that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that's beautiful. I fucking hate this card, but that's amazing. Th that looks like nothing like the other cards. Wow. That was the final pack, too. Woof. All right. Oh, well, good, good for that. Ooh. Full art foil. Sad robot. That's a good way to end it. Very beautiful. It's so, like, it, it. the art is already so shiny. And then they add the foiling to it, and it's just like, damn, dude. Wonderful. Look at that. Fuck it. What the fuck, man? This is amazing. That is an amazing card. Wow. Well, all right. Those are some good-ass fucking hits, man. Good-ass hits. Ugin Extended is 41 right now. All right. This is the last time I'll say it about my hands. They're stained. They're clean as hell. My hands are clean. They're stained because I went foraging for black walnuts, and I picked up one that was not dried out, and those things stain your hands like motherfuckers. I got, there's a stain right here. It's not... There's, yeah, there's like a stain running all up my finger. It's not... It's not dirt. It's just stain. That shit stains like a like a mother. Um, all right, let's go through some of these super chats. Those are some good pulls, man. This is fucking fantastic pulls. On the, I mean, of course, they're the fucking collector's packs, but I mean, look at that. Look, ageless inside. You know, actually, just just for the just for the heck of it, uh, can I? Yeah. Oh, are they here? I opened one the other day. And uh, I'll show you the pulls from that one, the, the rare pulls. All right, let me open this fucker up. <laughs> oh, wait, this is my regular, regular box opening. Yeah, here we go. All right. Got that Volcanic Salvo, the Nine Lives. We got another Grim Tutor. The Harbinger. Got that fucking Garrick, baby. Although some some in the chat are claiming it's Jarek. I don't know. Garrick. Pack Leader, Foil. And then Pack Leader, Foil, but not Extended. That Full Art Heroic Inventon. In heroic Intervention. Got that. Is that a Foil Chandra? Yeah. Foil Chandra. Heart of Fire. Beautiful. Got that incinerator, full art foil feline, temple of malady. Ugh, oh, that lily. I take it back. I do love this art. God, that's good. That is good. Idol of endurance, regular foil grim tutor. Very nice. Got that rada. That's. I think I, I think I pulled two of these and put that in the front just to. Foil double vision. Foil care of regular primal might. But yep, two cultivates. Fucking wild, right? Got that volcanic salvo, preserved whale, full art thieves. Another <laughs> stunt foil though. Full art sublime. Full art blight fang. Oh, look at these. So cool. This set is great, man. This set's real it's got a lot of power. They're bringing a lot of yeah, full art veto. Love that. They're bringing a lot of power. Uh, into this set. A lot of power. And I am A-OK -okay with that. A-OK. -okay. Oh, but man, you know what? That, that That's it for my Sunday. Uh, let's go through some of these Super Chats and talk to you for a little bit before I 
before I head off. I am getting a little hungry. I'm getting a little, uh, getting a little mind numb, if you will. Shame about that Urza Saga box. No Gaia's Cradle, but definitely awesome with the, the Talarian Academy and the Gilded Drake. That Gilded Drake was fucking choice. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, let's let's just let's like find those and put them out. Put them out on display here. Got the academy. Contamination's a pretty good one. Got the Drake. Are those the only big big hits? Uh, got a lot of Titanias. Carpet of Flowers. Yeah, those are the big hits. Alright, just to, just to enjoy the work that we've done together today. <clears throat> Alright. Potato Whiskers, got to you. Isaiah, I haven't caught one of your streams since the 24-hour Kingdom Hearts stream. I dearly treasure you reading my name as Isaiah amidst your delirium. <laughs> Did I just do it again? Oh, God. Asia. Asia. Uh, Lindsay Flack, hi. I just wanted to thank you for shaping my personality growing up. Even though I don't watch Grumps anymore, it's still a big part of my identity. Wow, that's really, that's really sweet. Um, thank you. Uh, it's okay that you don't watch Grumps anymore. It's fine. <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> uh, Kyle, Ka Kai Quirin, uh, nearly fell off my chair when I saw you in the audience of Drag Race Season 10 finale. That's right, yeah. Uh, the, Michelle Visage and I are, are good friends. Uh, hope you had a good time. Also, again, Mike, who cheese Harry? <laughs> I don't know what that means. KP, in Modern, there is a Snoop Goblin combo deck infinite. Oh, interesting. Yeah, that makes sense. He, he seems like kind of a fucky card. Kind of messes with the rules of the game. Frontier Gamers, yes, definitely do Kill Team or 40k. Been playing it on Tabletop Sim with mates. Hard to learn, but once you get it, it's flowing and fun. Can't wait to hear more on the RPGs card game idea you had from... Yeah, still working on that. Um, I hope everybody enjoyed the stickers. That was just sort of a fun little thing. Just to put out like a little cheaper product and to put out stuff that has more like interaction with the characters. Uh, Fendic Fendictus. Hey Aaron, do you have plans on saving these box opening streams? Your great luck has been great fun to watch coupled with your fun personality. Gosh, that's very sweet. Um, yes, I'm going to put them on a channel called Shuffle Master. Uh, Goaty Fett. I manage a game store and we here would love to build you in the Grumpies a cube. Grumpty's a cube. Let me know. Uh, yeah, I would fucking love that. Are you kidding me? Um, certainly not requesting that you do that, but that that would it would be awesome. It would be really cool. Uh, thank you. Uh, uh, give, give me your store so I can shout it out. Uh, Restless Soul Alex, will there be an announcement when Shuffle Master goes up? Yes, absolutely. Will it mostly be pack openings, or will you also make videos of playing? Yeah, I'll make videos of playing. You know, I'm not the greatest at playing. Um, I just like to do stupid shit. Uh, I guess I'm a Timmy at heart. Um, but I do have some good decks. I, I do have, like, the good decks, where it's like, okay, if there's an event going on, I'll be like, okay, I'll bust out the good decks. But for the most part, I just like to be like, oh, can I make a deck that's just, like, Hydras, and it's fucking weird and fucky? Like, that's... That's, that's my approach to, to playing Magic the Gathering. Uh, Nicole Marie. Hi, King. <laughs> Hello. Uh, hope you're safe during quarantine for you and Dan. Bring a smile to my face while I've been working through this whole shutdown. Also, listen to Chromatica by Lady Gaga. Okay. I, I used to love Lady Gaga. Christian. Hey, dude. Love you and Dan. By any chance, have you ever eaten hot Cheeto? I'm not into hot spicy food. If not, what's your favorite chip? Um, it is Ruffles, Sour Cream, and Cheddar. Love that chip. I would guess maybe Barbecue Lay's. Uh, yeah, you know, I, I will, I, I will never choose the Barbecue Lay's, but if it's all there is, I can definitely get in them where I'm like, oh, these are good. Uh, Kai White, 
Aaron, I love you so much. You've helped me so much. Thank you, Kai. You're you're always here, fucking throwing throwing down. I, I really appreciate that. Um. Ah. Someone wants to get muted. <laughs> ah! All right. Um, Nicole Marie. Hi, love you and Dan. You guys have helped me while working through this whole quarantine. Hope you're both safe and healthy. Also listen to Chromatica by Lady Gaga. Thank you once again for that. Uh, I shall. Ben, can you give a shout out to my boy Clifton for me? Been a minute since I saw him. Uh, what's up, Clifton? Big shout out. Um, <laughs> yeah, I noticed him. That's funny. Um, yeah, that's all super chats. Um, I'll just hang out for a little bit. This was fun, man. Um, it's a shame that it wasn't, like, a huge value box, but that's not what this is about, you know? I, I know there's a lot of people that are like, just buy the singles, and it's like, yeah, but the fun is opening them. I mean, we never would have had that, uh, never would have had that, uh, hold on, that Jordan and Larry experience, am I right? Like, these bad boys right here. That never would have happened. It's all about the joy, you know? It's not about the destination. It's about the journey. <laughs> yeah, plus I love gambling. That's uh, that's definitely a thing thing for me. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just sleeve these in the meantime. Whoa, all right. Uh, oh, is my like power okay? You know, the power might, <laughs> I might, my phone might die. Uh, what's the next box? That is a good question. What is the next box? Uh, let me know what box you want to see. I think the next opening that I'm going to do is a full collector's gamut. So it'll be all of the sets that have collector's boxes. Eldraine, Theros, Ikoria, and uh, Core 2021. I think I'm going to do that. Original Zendikar is very cool. Uh, you know, that is something that shows up a lot, so maybe I'll look into that. Um, that whole, the whole idea of, um, what, what are they called? The, the treasured finds or the tre the treasures, hidden treasures. I would love, oh, can you imagine pulling a lotus? That would be incredible. Jumpstart with Dan. Yeah, I do have a jumpstart box. Um, I was I was saving it for when this is all over and I can have some people over. And we can do a do a little sort of mini draft. Is it I mean, what would you call it? Just playing jumpstart? It's not really a draft. Innistrad, yeah, Innistrad was fun. Got that uh tragic slip. World wake. Okay. Oh shit, I dropped a fucking sleeve on the ground and my cat's gonna eat it. Where the fuck did it go? Whoa, actually, where did it go? What the fuck? It like totally vanished. <laughs> what the hell? No, I have to find it or my cat's gonna eat it. <laughs> ah! Jeez, is this it? What is this? Oh, it just, well, apparently that was on the floor. <laughs> what the? I don't know how that fell down there. Where the fuck is the the damn sleeve? Uh, I, I guess I'll look for it later. <laughs> uh oh, dragons are dark here. So. I have um, a couple boxes. Uh, I've got just just on hand. I've got those collectors, so I've got the the four collector sets. Um, I have oh, I got a Amonkhet and a Aether Revolt. So maybe we'll do another um, masterpiece hunt. Uh, that was fun. Fat, the when we got that rings, that was fantastic. Uh, and then I have 
the the gate crash block. I have all three of those. And then I have an Acoria box. So those will those are easy to open, but any special boxes. Lorwyn, yeah, Lorwyn's showing up a lot. Lorwyn Shattermore. Time Spiral. Yeah, that could be fun. Uh, yeah, Ka Kamigawa is dope. That's a that's a cool-ass block. Um, I hate the flip cards. Those are ugly as hell. And they're so confusing to look at. Uh, but there's a lot of dope cards from Kamigawa. Did Kamigawa start ninjutsu, or was that a different set? I, I I haven't played with any ninjutsu card yet. Oh, Ultimate Masters. Yeah. That would be fun to do. Is anyone into uh, Modern Horizons? Would anybody be interested in that? Modern Horizons is great. Okay. <laughs> Just a little, sure. Yeah, Modern Horizons got some some pretty pretty sick cards. That's um Renin 6. It's like a fifty dollar card. Have I played Hanafuda with Susie yet? No, but we played a lot of Mancala. Susie loved Mancala growing up. Battle Bond. That's more of like a draft set, though, right? You draft it, and then you you, you do a two headed two headed dragon. <sighs> Unhinged. <laughs> that would be funny. Okay, so I'm thinking probably like a Lorwyn uh, or a Shadowmore next. Um, and then we can do a masterpiece hunt. It'd be great to, it'd be great to do a full masterpiece hunt, you know, like do, get Aether Revolt, so I've got Aether Revolt and I've got Amonkhet, but then pick up an Hour of Devastation and a Kaladesh, and just do like the full masterpiece gamut, that'd be dope. Mirrodin. We did Mirrodin. That was that was fun. We got the Platinum Angel, which was hilarious. Oh, the Hello Kitty. Oh, you can see that? These are my pants. Susie, Susie made me these pants. No, actually, no. Susie didn't make these pants. But she's made me like a thousand pairs of pants that I love that are just like this. Uh... Battle for Zendikar. Oh yes, that's right. Zendikar and Gatewatch have uh, have the expeditions. Wow, six boxes in one day. Maybe I'll split it up. Uh, okay. Let's go to the super chats for a little bit. I. Leona, sadly, someone is trying to updog you, my dude. If you say Mike who cheese Harry fast, you will get it. Mike who cheese Harry. Mike who cheese. Mike who cheese Harry. Got it. Also, any music you're super into lately? Um, uh, what are they called? Gravity something. Yeah, I just put on Spotify. And I'm just like, just give me what I like. I don't even know who half the artists are. Uh, Harriet, one more dono for me as I was able to stay up for the whole stream tonight and loved it. Thanks, Aaron. Hey, thank you. I really appreciate you coming every time. Goaty Fett, how do I get you a cube from Oasis Games? Uh, just send it to the P.O. Box. Um, it's on our uh, uh, YouTube channel, on the About page. Uh, Game Reps YouTube channel. 
Uh, KP, thanks for the great stream, Aaron. Until next time. Thanks, thanks for coming, man. You're always, you're always here. You always, you know, we didn't get the cradle, but, uh, but uh, you still, you still call, you, you still put the effort in. I appreciate that. Um, I mean, Leafy on. Uh, big fans and sequelitis caught you on Long Island back in October. One of the most fun shows ever. Hope the Backstreet Boys stop hogging the venue so you guys can get back to touring. Yeah, me too. Very excited for that. Very excited to get back on the road. Another fat gamer. Hey, Aaron, just want to say thank you for the latest GG vids this week and for streaming. Just had a breakup and all of those have been helping me out. Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that. Fucking life goes on, man. Like, you'll look back at this and be like, oh, man, fucking, what was I thinking? So, 